<laughs> Guys, happy Friday. You know you found like that sweet spot with a game when you're like craving playing it at like seven in the morning. I woke up and I was like, I wanna be streaming right now. I'm so excited to be here, guys. Welcome back in. Anon popping off with all of the gifted subs to the channel and community, dude. Thank you so much. And going back up, I see Mr. Chill. Oh, is it? Is it somebody's birthday? Is it somebody's birthday? Are you guys sure? <laughs> Great. Happy stinking birthday. I hope it's been all amazing. Although you said you had to work today. But also, to be fair, I'm pretty sure even when I was in my old job, I worked every single day was my birthday. Like I never had off unless it was on a Saturday. But guys in chat, can we please get a huge happy birthday to Crate? Um, just an incredible part of this community and this channel and just always spreading joy wherever he goes. So thank you. And also you better be going to TwitchCon 2024. Indian guy, welcome back in. Spyro, hi. We actually have a few birthdays too. Gar, welcome back in. FF7, hello. Thess, this is kind of loud. I think I must have been listening to Spotify earlier or something because that's way louder than normal. Yanks. Yanks with five gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Dude. Mike from Jersey with the reset for three months in a row as well. Joko, thank you for the 200 bits, y'all. It's not my birthday. 100 and apparently it is. Happy birthday. Alas. I still don't know this part. Such admirable. I don't know half of you half as well as I should like, and I like less than half of you half as well as you deserve. Yoda man, welcome back in. I will learn the beginning part though. I will get the beginning part. Scarlet, welcome back in. And also Big Mar, welcome in. I burned my shoulder when I was curling my hair, by the way. And so I'm just trying to like, I'm trying to hold up like cold drinks to it or something. I'm currently watching your Outer Wilds part four and I'm loving the game. New to the channel. Well, welcome in. I love how you conduct your crate. Crate, it's your birthday. No, take it back. Take it back. Spend it on yourself for goodness sakes. Take it back. <laughs> Guys, please, if you haven't already said happy birthday to Crate, please do. I'm not getting my shoulder really hurt, so I'm going to hold this for a second. I'm already loving how you conduct your videos. I'm super interested to see what you have excited for live today. Yes, well, welcome in, Big Mar, and anybody who's come over from YouTube, guys, welcome in, um, especially if it's your first time in. I'm picking back up with Cyberpunk. If you're like in Outer Wilds, I'm glad to see you guys are. I'm trying to abstain from the comment section just because I've heard that this one can be spoiled pretty easily. But yeah, so far, it seems like a lot of you guys are enjoying it. I am thoroughly enjoying the game. I feel like it's one of those games that's going to keep me up at night with just different routes I could have taken or things I could have done differently, but I'm trying to stick with my choices and be like confident in what I've done so far. And it's just been a blast. I think I actually should finish it tomorrow. I think I'll finish it tomorrow before stream as well. Oh my goodness, this is actually really bad. <laughs> this is bad. Uh, Vess, welcome back in as well. And Sigmar, yes, again, or Big Mar, again, thank you for taking the time to pop over from YouTube. I really appreciate that from anybody who has. Um, once you come here, you kind of can't escape, especially if you come from the YouTube side of things. It happens. We have a lot of people here now that came from YouTube and have stayed from YouTube. Cornell, welcome back in Texas, Shrimp. Hi. I see Classy's here as well. I did. I seared my flesh. It's actually pretty bad. I mean, I don't think you can see it because I already have a scar from like when I was a kid up there, but I heard it pretty bad. Cornell, Evil Mango, I see. Data, welcome back in. JJ, hi. JJ, hello. Wait, I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything else. Yanks with the five gifted subs. Tricky Buzz with six months of continual support as well. Tricky, thank you so much. It's tricky to rock around. I will always think of that. Lefron, thank you for the follow. And also Dave with the resub for 14 months in a row. And thanks to Raging. Is Raging here right now? Raging, welcome back in as well. Did I ever get a chance to play? Wait, let me scroll down to see that. I have not. You starting Cyberpunk Let's Play will probably make me stick on the Twitch for a while. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm not doing it on the YouTube side of things. I know. I actually have had a lot of people on my main channel be like, I can't believe you gave Cyberpunk to Twitch. It's like a competition between you guys or something. It's like two different sides. And then there's y'all that are on both sides that are like, I'm fine with either. But no, it's been, I think still like looking back at it, I've never taken on a game that's this large on the YouTube side of things. And I think that this is good. I think I need to stick 
with longer games such as this being on the Twitch side of things, I'll miss a couple of details. Couple of details. I'll miss a lot of stuff, but. I think all in all, it was the better choice to make. Also, I would still be playing this by the time FF7 comes out and none of you guys would have wanted that, okay? Nobody would have wanted us waiting on FF7 because of Cyberpunk, you know? Lan, I think it's really, it's kind of one of those interesting things to watch, especially from my perspective because so many people on the YouTube side don't realize that I've been doing Twitch for over five years. So a lot of times they either think I just started or they think that you guys get priority, which you do. <laughs> no, I mean, but it kind of makes sense. I'm, I started on Twitch, this is my main thing. And I think I've been very transparent about that even on the Twitch side of things or on the YouTube side of things that Twitch is my, I would say, I mean, they're both my priority now, but I often still feel like this is my main, this is like the main portion of it, if that makes sense. Grim, welcome back in. Although that's been really hard to mentally shift because I didn't expect YouTube to be doing as well as it has. So it's just really, it's getting more and more difficult to decipher which is best for what. But Alan, thank you for the follow. I see Mr. I see Daniel. Hello, Cobra. Hi. This is my hangout hub. That's such a good, yeah. I mean, I feel like this is like my coffee shop. This is where I go just to connect with you guys and get to like talk about more things. And also I get to share a little bit more about myself. And I guess I could do like a Q&A on YouTube or stuff, but I, I don't know. It's... I, it's somewhat a little less, I think, lonely, or maybe I can understand it a little bit more when we talk and have an open flow conversation. Whereas like then I would have to wait for the comments. Like I would put out information out there. Whereas I like it feeling like a dialogue. It feels more like a dialogue over here. A chai tea latte, I've got you. I actually only have matcha in stock. All right. We Jamie, hi. I don't know how to do coffee art. I don't, I don't know how to do coffee art. You're going to get, <laughs> I can do some sprinkles, edible sprinkles. We'll do something like that. I don't know much more connectivity here. Yeah. I mean, I try really hard to make sure it feels like a community over on the YouTube side as well. But even you guys, like we talk about it, I don't post nearly as much on the community page over there um, as I post over here as well. But I also feel like I'm bugging. I don't know why posting on YouTube community page feels much more it feels different than just like posting on Discord. It feels a lot more like a public announcement versus like when I'm commenting in Discord, it just feels more casual. Does that make sense? Woof, welcome back in. Yeah, it, it's just, it's incredible to see how many people don't realize that this is like what I've been doing and why I was even able to start YouTube in the first place. You know, uh, Django, Discord, 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 Discord is home, exactly. Also HZ, Flank, thank you for the prime sub and welcome in as well. And McBuzzin, thank you for eight months of continual support. HZ, where did you come from? I see it's your first time subbing, welcome in. And I see Jeff, welcome back in. Let Legends here. I am so excited to just dive into whatever we get into today. I think we're picking up with Rogue. We're picking up with a main mission, actually. Yes, we are. That's going to be awesome. Retro, welcome back in. Sir Fresco, hello. Candidate, yeah. I'm the weirdest. I think you guys get more goofs on YouTube, though, I will say. Shinra, hello. Django as well. Dark Rice, hi. And no. No. <laughs> London. I need to make it bigger because I will say that I feel like it should be bigger, especially when you're having blue knees played. I still hate you. <laughs> we should make it take up the whole screen. <laughs> London always embarrassing me the most. AJ also, thank you for 14 months and for the tier three sub the whole time. London with 50 gifted subs to the channel and community got y'all, y'all. <laughs> Great, I hope you enjoyed that on your birthday especially. London, thank you for 50 gifted subs to the channel and community as well. What in the world? <laughs> Uh, Shas, welcome back in. Co wait, 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 wait. I'm scrolling. I'm trying to catch up with everything. Constellation. YouTube feels like new friends. It does. It does. I think that's probably, I think it's kind of cool because I think whenever you guys come in from YouTube, I think you enjoy the atmosphere so much more, probably because it's so established over here, because it already feels like a home when you pop in, especially because I've been doing it for so long. 
Yeah. Uh, Matthew, I see Matthew, welcome back in. Yoda Man's here, Mr. Chill. Am I crazy for thinking I could actually pull off some basic latte art, even if I've never tried it before? Now I kind of want to try it. I do miss doing art, so maybe that's what I'll get into. But isn't it just, it's just pouring the cream, right? So you would just pour, mmm. I reckon it's kind of like, have you guys ever, like I know in art class we used to get challenged with never letting the pen leave the paper. So you'd have to like create something with lines, but never take the pen off. It's gotta be something kind of like that. But then you kind of whip it up. No, cause you can remove it. Like you could pour a little bit of, like you could do a line. I'm, I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna try this. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do it. They seem slightly hostile. This place is cozy. <laughs> well, this place is a lot more regulated. I also don't really like, it's very rare that I'll not regulate, but like if somebody wants to say something mean, like I'm not, I'm not going to like remove it. it. It is what it is. Like, I don't I don't care. It's not going to impact me the way that they hope it does. And so I think over here it's able to be a lot more curated because people know that if they say something, if they mess around, they're going to get banned. You're going to get timed out. You're going to get force choked, you know, spazzy. Also, all the tier threes today is spazzy. <laughs> Spazzy with eight, 16, I almost said 18 months, with 16 months of continual support as well at tier three. Thess, welcome back in. Yanks with the gifted sub to legend as well. I've heard that the best cure for burns is gingy cuddles. I have heard this. I was thinking this is something really random and it sounds kind of silly. I also am so behind on saying, no. Today is my 11th birthday. You know I can't not say it. I still need to this. It's burning so much. Such ad. I always want to go straight to admirable. I just think you guys are admirable. So you half as well as I should like, and I like less than half of you half as well as you deserve. Who played that again? Death and Jane, guys, thank you for the follows. Mr. Simplistic as well. And London with the thousand bits. And also there was somebody else who did a thousand bits. Noctis, thank you for four months of continual support. Choco did a thousand bits. Choco, thank you so much for thousand bits as well was that bear that sounds like it was bear or something obi-wan thank you for seven months as well thank you so much and raj another tier three raj with how many months has it been 17 months whoa Yeehaw! i'm a cowboy raj has been subbed longer than spazzy that seems weird i feel like you guys subbed at the same time oh my gosh it's coarse, coarse and rough, rough and, and irritating, irritating. And it, it gets, gets everywhere. everywhere. <laughs> Jay, with the Prime sub too. Why are there so many Prime subs? Jay, thank you so much for the Prime sub as well. Thank you. Axe, welcome back in. Lard, did I finish Red Rising yet? No, I'm actually really close. I and like sand. It's, it's coarse. coarse. Rough, rough and, and irritating. irritating. And, and it, it gets, gets everywhere. everywhere. Speaking of the birthday boy himself, Crate gifted the Juniper edition of red rising series so i have all three books now so i'm looking forward to i think once the that set arrives i'll allow myself to finish red rising but our first book club meeting is going to be on wednesday on the first well, half of the book essentially so yes we have our first meeting i know and then there's more after the first three right yes but i think the juniper edition is just the first three and it's the most gorgeous i mean i have the lord of the rings juniper edition as well and they're beautiful but have you guys ever heard of this jess was telling me about this it's like a monthly book subscription but they send you special cover books and you can pass on it but you don't always have to I, I don't know exactly what it's called but she was talking about it yes we have a book club meeting yes and for anybody who has enjoyed and you're interested or you've already read red rising and you just want to hop in on the book club it is such a cozy space on the discord you just have to ask to be a part of it um it's like fight club nobody talk no uh just say that you want to be a part of it you'll see the instructions on crack <laughs> on the discord <laughs> we <laughs> crack <laughs> we are constantly doing a ton of different awesome books and i would have never read red rising if it wasn't for the book club so if you're just even trying to get into reading more you don't have to read every single book you don't have to keep up with it but if there's one that piques your interest you guys are welcome to join for and it's a lot of fun there's so many incredible i know i broke the rule i did it i did it <laughs> I'm usually too busy, busy, busy to finish a book, but I'm trying to read Red Rising. You should, uh, if you have gotten to halfway, definitely hop in for the book club meeting. Um, there's such excellent points and discussion that happen, and every single meeting I feel like gets better and better. 
because more people get more comfortable with it too. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that's just on Discord. And also, Avocado. Is it Avocado? Thank you for the follow. And Lady with six months as well. Lady, thank you so much. I hope you're having a great Friday. It feels weird because I never, I never stream on Fridays. Listening while at work, being a lurker. Baron, enjoy the lurky turkiness. Get that work done. Mario, welcome in as well. And Noriak's here. Noriak, welcome back in as well. The book club is in the Discord. Yeah, and anybody, any and all are welcome. So you'll hop in and you just, you'll just you see one section that's available to you. And it just you just have to say that you want to be a part of the book club. And then uh, my admins will add you as part of that. And then the first book club meeting you'll find at the top of the Discord. Yep. The fantasy football league this year who was wait wait who won actually that's a good point who did win i even kept up with that we started that but dark star <sighs> you can use a stencil and a sprinkle cocoa powder choco i like that a stencil for it i could do that kevin kevin with the thousand bits what is happening and fridays are chaotic <laughs> It's coarse, coarse and rough, rough and, and irritating. irritating. And it gets, it gets everywhere. Fridays are unhinged. You guys brought it. Friday frenzy. Is this what happens when you guys are all off work for the weekend? You're just like, oh my gosh, we get cyberpunk three days in a row. We're going wild. App, <laughs> app, also ah, with. App with the gifted wonders. sub to the channel and community as well. Spyro with the hydrate, y'all. Hmm. <laughs> I have nothing here. I'm just. I'm a. I'm a fool at this point. All right, so before you guys attack me, also thank you. Oh my God. Darvas, <laughs> did you just add? Creed has made it. Creed has made I didn't add it. Yeah, I did I'm a cowboy. Scarlet, welcome back here. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Craig. That one sounds better. That one's <laughs> it might be the same one. Berg, welcome back in. And D, hi. Um, for the hydrate. I know you guys are gonna come at me as soon as I show this, but I really have been trying to cut out. I really have. However, when a new flavor drops, one does not simply avoid it. And so there's a new flavor called Cherry Twist. And it, uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I know, but it was a new flavor. What was I supposed to do? What was I supposed to <laughs> Dark Pass, thank you for the Creed alerts now. I have a feeling that's going to get spammed. Hey, hey, hey. Nonstop. Hey, 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 hey. I do, I do, I do, I do. Yeah, yeah, it's not a great time to drink an energy drink. I'm definitely going to be up all night, but I feel like I am anyway. You know, just going to go straight to it. I was quitting it, but then, you know, tell me that's not life, though. I really had reduced my intake on Alani's over the past week. I want you guys to know I have. And then all of a sudden I roll up into Target because if you guys know, there's a new set of Pokemon that are dropping today. So I roll up at seven to try to get a box of this Pokemon. By the way, they were completely sold out already. Um, so, I mean, I guess they'd hit the shop. I was a little late. I was, I got there at 7.30, so I didn't get there right at seven. And so they said that they had already sold out. I'm addicted to Pokemon now. And I saw this flavor. And I, I couldn't, I couldn't. Matrico, by the way, welcome in. And also Functional, welcome back in. I also see Filtered Synth, Pie, a lot of books I've been reading eventually. The club is brought to my attention. Yes, same, same. I know I'm catching back up, but Ashley, welcome back into two addictions at the same time. Exactly. Although I think I only fell back in love with Pokemon collecting because it was the 151 that I was looking at. I realize now that I'm not up to date with any of these new Pokemon. So I think we need to start playing some Pokemon games too. The 151 set that was coming back out. Yeah, Spyro, welcome back in. The new Sour Apple Ghosts are really good. I haven't tried that. I haven't had a, I haven't had a ghost in a long time. Everybody's talking about Pal World and this was not on my radar at all. Where did it come from? Have we all known that it was going to come out? It just feels like I thought no games were coming out this year other than, okay, maybe I've had my Final Fantasy blinders on, but still, 
I didn't even realize. I hate that game. You don't like it? Just continue, by the way. Welcome back in. Thalmusai. Where did it come from? Where did it go? We'll never know. Brunsto with 27 months and London. Thank you for three months to Sarah as well. Sarah, welcome back in. Faithful Liar, thank you for the follow. And anybody that I've missed and all the lurky turkeys, guys, welcome back in. Happy Friday. I'm excited to start out this cyberpunk like bonanza with you guys. I mean, we've got Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. That's a lot. Maybe I'll just stream on Tuesday too. Maybe I'll make it a five just to all day. We'll just binge it. My attention's all on Tekken 8. I didn't even realize that Tekken came out. I didn't realize that that was happening. There's so many games. Elm, welcome back in. I did see, uh, I think Elijah was playing Tekken. I think I saw that he was playing Elijah. Or he was playing Tekken. Cyberpunk Bonanza is a great band name. <laughs> oh, and you guys will be so happy to hear this. I was at the gym yesterday and I was like, I'm, I'm gonna listen to the Cyberpunk soundtrack and that song came on the song from the anime and i've just been listening to it nonstop. i actually had it on repeat for my entire workout and i've never quite realized i always thought that the key to having a good workout was to listen to like bumping up songs like i'm talking depends but sometimes i'll get a little angsty i'll listen to a little disturbed we'll see what happens you know I didn't realize that listening to depressing songs actually unlo like unleashes a whole new PR for me in every category. Not Pon Pon, no. Um, let me see which one it's favored. I didn't realize that getting in my feels in the middle of a like, set. I'm not kidding. To be fair, it kind of is a bop at the same time. It's not like that sad, but uh, I really want to stay at your house. Yeah, I really want to stay at your house. That was so good. Stupefy by Disturbed is my go-to. Mine is uh, Inside the Fire. Is it Inside the Fire I think I'm thinking of? Yeah, I think so. New Ability Unlocked Frost. Yeehaw! Yes. I'm a also, <laughs> Beans, Beans, thank you. I know. I enjoy your YouTube Cyberpunk videos. I'm glad to see you guys are enjoying the VODs. Like, truly. I cannot, like, tell you guys. I'm sorry. I put, like, lotion on and it's, like, feels sticky. Oh, I don't know. New PR for thumb lifts. <laughs> J Rocks, welcome back in. I assume you just had Hamilton on repeat at the gym. I have at times. Look, just tell me when and I will blast it out. I'm kind of partially rewatching uh, Curb Your Enthusiasm a little bit. And I did just get to the season where Lin Manuel is on it. And it's the whole skit about Lin Manuel. I think it's the end of season 10 or 9. Crate. Crate? I said sorry. Great. Thank you for five gifted subs to the channel. A community, you can't stop. No more. No more. I'm not saying sorry again for the rest of today. JJ, Misfit Toys by it. Ah, uh, there were a couple of other ones that I added, but I think I just clicked on the wrong cyberpunk playlist because not all the songs were there, including the song. I was trying to find the song that was like, um, hey, 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 hey. hey. Trying to find the song. You know my favorite beat when we're in my little car and it's like, I'm a big man doing big man things. <laughs> I was trying to find that one and it was not popping up. I also wanted to tell you guys that I tried the rower at the gym and I think I'm convinced I'm gonna get a rower instead of a uh, bike. I think I'm gonna get an outdoor bike, but an inside rower. And that's what I'm gonna go with. Yeah. Sometimes when I see, I, I know, I know. No, it's just some incredibly generous people. Capone's welcome back in. Yeah, the radio songs are split into multiple albums on Spotify, so there, nobody's created like an all-encompassing one. That's kind of a bummer. Yes, I listened to Pon Pon. I did. I listened to it, and then I felt... I felt... uplifted, but also I was... I, I think I was just... I... <laughs> I was cognizant of the fact that you guys would relish this moment if I... <laughs> Told, like yeah I just I wanted to like it but I know that you guys want me to like it and so that much more I don't want to like it <laughs> I feel like this is just gonna be something I'll never unhear you know bigger man yes yes that's it dark <laughs> yes <laughs> there is 
one of the only machines I enjoy using is the rowing machine. Guys, I did it for five minutes and I was I was done. I was done. That was too much. Five minutes and I think I feel my back is a little sore today. But I was wondering, I'm assuming it also works out your legs a fair bit. There are agencies that have switched from the run to rowing machines for the PT test. Really? Um, I remember a while ago they were talking about how one of the, I think one of the Oh gosh, was it the Marines? No, was it Army? One of them were testing out different PT requirements outside of the run, but I can't remember which one it was. But I must have heard of what you were talking about. Wooski, hi, knack. It was definitely past my time. Yeah, it was not gonna hit the Air Force before I pounced. Nope, wooski, hi. Just go get a rowboat and row in the lakes. All right, I'll go find some lakes by my house. I'm on it, I'm on it. I did a brilliant thing and bought shares from the company that makes energy drinks I love. So when I buy, I support myself. <laughs> no, I need to stop this. I need to stop it. It was funny because the other day I was walking past, I was doing, I was walking past something and I was like, wow, Alani hasn't come out with a new flavor in a while. And sure, lo and behold, be careful what you wish for. Okay, be careful. Drop it like it's hot. Uh, there are a couple other songs that I saved, but I forgot about. Zawa, thank you so much for seven months as well. And Aaron with eight months of continual support. Guys, thank you. Aaron. Aaron? My doc told me to stop running consistent pace running. Said it was bad for, yeah, wait, lowers testosterone? Said to do interval training or weight training instead. Huh. I didn't heard that it lowers testosterone. I thought it was bad for your knees. Like, I knew it wasn't the best for it. You passed your sec plus cert. Doug, congratulations. So my brain is officially fried. Oh, man. Congratulations, though. That is such a feat. Please celebrate. Do something for yourself. Watch a movie. Go to the movies. Blue Magus, welcome back in as well. That is a good point, though. Maybe I should do something like that. Just when I think I'm out, they pull me back in. This is such, yeah, it always happens like this. This is like when I'm in Outer Worlds and I swear the game knows when I'm onto something or have discovered something and it does that thing that I'm not going to spoil, but that thing, if you know, you know, you know. I don't miss 6am PT for that reason, are you dang sure? Okay. Why, family? Why? Why must you call me when I'm working? Drop it? Wait, okay, I saw that. They're considering doing deadlifts instead of running? Not sure what conclusion, way past my time. I mean, I, I don't know if I would have preferred that or not. I haven't done push out or put push ups in a long time, probably since when I got out. What's my gym workout frequency? I probably go four to five times a week. I would say four to five times a week. One of the days is typically one of the days is more cardio and sauna focused. And a lot of times I'd go for stair stepping. But other than that, I have like an even split between them. I do my like back and buys, tries and chest. Ooh. Actually, I'm starting to kind of like chest day. I am. I think the stronger you get with any of the categories, the more you enjoy them. Shoulder day will always be my favorite. I miss the camaraderie of the Navy. Not much else though. Definitely not running. No, I absolutely agree. I made some amazing connections and I think that the longer you stay out, the more you have to be intentional about your friendships as you get older. Friendships are hard to create when you get older, but even harder to maintain. And I, I definitely fell out with a lot of people that add the more years that go by as well. Peter and Sam, guys, thank you for the follows as well. And dark with the hydrate. Mm. Bench press master. Mm. Light blue. You guys always want blue or green. Where? I mean, I guess those are really like the only other. You want the light blue? Thank you for actually telling me too. Ginger's pad is here, but I don't think she's going to come in today. I do have it open for her just in case she does want to. Oh, that's nice. I like it. I like it. Balri, what's up? Welcome in. You came from Anna? Oh, how was today? Smoogie, thank you for the follow as well. Leg workout suck. I actually really hate leg day. I despise leg day. I do it as like minimal as possible. Manuel, thank you so much as well. It's returning to my natural color, not in the front, but like all the back pieces and everything that's my natural. I see a snook, snook, welcome back in dark. Uh, she's doing the second one, right? And also not hazy. Thank you for the follow as well. I do like the light colors, especially now that I have more of a neutral uh, shade behind. I mean, if you guys remember, I used to do a lot more like purple RGBs behind, but I I switched to more of this like neutral background color because I figured with the fireplace, we'll be changing it back there anyway. So 
second one has been interesting there will come a time when we play that i was actually splitting up my steam games uh, as to uh what i want to play for youtube and what i want to play for twitch and i have a lot of shorter maybe like 20 hour games that i want to do with you guys after cyberpunk after cyberpunk also danny welcome back in as well only one i don't like is shoulders i love shoulder day i love shoulder day oh i would do shoulder day every day if i could I'm entirely sure friendships are harder to create when you get older. I feel it's more than a natural op. Or, yeah, there's less not. Yeah, absolutely. There's less natural opportunities. Getting into new schools, starting colleges. Um, and also, I mean, if you think if about the. Beast you be, I, I have, have no, no choice. choice. If you think about the opportunities when you get older, a lot of times you turn to work. But I think there is something to be said for. I've created some friends in workplaces, but I also think that it's important to remember that you guys are still colleagues. Um, and so I think it's important to find a diverse set of friends, have a couple that are colleagues, have a couple maybe from hobbies that you like to do or stuff like that. But I, I used to like look to one spot to get all my friends. And I think now more than ever, I need to diversify. Yoda, Yoda high. Yeah. I see J-Rock's gym schedule Monday, sauna, Tuesday, massage, Wednesday's tanning, Thursday's mingle at a shake bar, Friday, stare at the mirror. <laughs> that almost sounds like um, the Grinch. Remember when the Grinch goes through his list of things? McBuzz and I. Okay, I saw that. 20 hour games like Subnautica, Drash. You're starting to sound like Ryan with Halo. Your Halo is Subnautica, Drash. I realize now that I'm pretty sure you're only sticking around until I play Subnautica and then you're like, finally, I'm out. I did it. I got it. I feel the burn on the yeah. shoulders. Dude, I, the I'm shoulder there. burn. This is actually really bad and I'm glad that I grabbed this poppy. I truly am. My shoulders were nice and round when I was my most consistent. I just love when you, I, I, there's certain exercises that you enjoy like watching yourself do in the mirror. And I think shoulders is one of those, even though the gym, gyms are always skewed to make you look better. You know, the light, well, it either, it's, it's either or, but a lot of gyms have that perfect lighting that just makes your shoulder look jacked. And I'm like, man, I thought I had traps. I don't, I don't. I don't. My previous job was wild. Everyone was young, lots of party and intermingling and office drama. See, that was the opposite. I was the youngest at my previous job. And so I didn't really create friends through that um, unless they were like some of our, we worked with some military members. So those were like the younger ones, but I just felt like I wasn't really able to. Yeah. Uh, I actually injured my shoulder at work. Hold on, let me scroll down. Ruby and I, I keep my professional and personal lives completely separate. Yeah, I think the older I get, I think in when I was younger, I did look to workplaces to create friends and the older I get, I do think it's difficult. I think when you're doing this, this presents a little bit of a different situation. Um, it's a little bit more complex because if you think about it, you make friendships, but I do think it's important to find emphasis in this career on creating colleagues. Um, I think that there's this really blurred line between where people see you more as competition than as a colleague. And there's, it's a whole different world trying to find friends in this industry as well, but then it can be incredibly lonely as well. So you kind of need to. Most of my friends are from the internet. Yeah. Um, my best friends that also helped me get into streaming and everything were all from League of Legends and stuff. Yeah. Do, do, do. Immunity, welcome back in. What are these sad talkings? We're, no, we're going to get into Cyberpunk. We're going to get into Cyberpunk. <laughs> London with the gift of the Squiddy as well. Diplomatic immunity and also BEP. Guys, thank you for the follows and welcome in. Devin, thank you as well. No, I... League, when it first started, I don't think it was as toxic as it is now. I actually just think... Uh, maybe that's not true. I don't I don't know. I made some of my best friends from League and Destiny. Destiny too, actually. My PC is my best friend. Do we have an option to disable and oh my gosh, we're doing this one time and then I'm re-enabling it. I cannot believe you guys remember that. I cannot. Are we still mourning Jackie? Absolutely. A hundred percent. Yes, for being able to intermingle. I've had entirely too many issues spring up and getting older, having a kid. It feels naturally to be extremely picky. I'm still extremely picky and I, I don't even think it's being extremely picky. I just also think that you have increasingly less and less time, um, especially when you do have other responsibilities the older you get. And so you should be picky. You should be picky with friends. I, I think absolutely. I've never looked and been like, I need more friends. 
as in I'm okay just having one best friend. I'm okay just having two best friends. Like, I don't feel like I need to have 20. I don't think I could give energy to 20 people. I feel like I barely am good at juggling my friendship, honestly, with Anna and Jess, like just without even my outside friends from this uh, career as well. One in Ryan, guys, thank you for the follows as well. I'd rather have competition at work than friends, than, yeah, than stuff just get done. I just kind of like, I think, I think even in my old job, I never, it was never about competition, but you could see your, I think I, you could see where you were trying to get to more easily. Like the corporate ladder is much easier to know, like defined spots to where to go next. When I switched to this career, your progression is your own pace. So it's really easy to look at other people and compare your progression to somebody else's story. But just like when you go to the gym and you look at that person, you're like, oh my gosh, I wanna be where they're at. They've been doing this for like seven years. So how can you say that your day two is gonna be their, what is their day, their year seven or something, you know? Um, but yeah, yeah. I mean, I think that a lot of people probably look at it as your numbers, but I don't think that's like a healthy, I don't think that is a healthy way to see success in this career. I think it's actually gonna be a very shallow way for you to see success in this career because it'll never be enough. Your numbers can always go higher, right? So it's never gonna feel sad. You're never gonna feel satisfaction in it because it can always be more and more and more. And then you get in this like vicious cycle. So I think you need to look at other things as goals and as like what you're trying to work towards. Imagine if my friends list was like my game tier list. Imagine if my friends list was like my wish list. That'd be, I don't, I wouldn't be able to do anything. I know. Sounds like the biggest pressure comes from yourself a hundred percent, but that's not even to do with what job I do. That's just being an overachiever and a perfectionist at heart. Like that I was molded in that. That wasn't, it didn't matter what I did. Grumpus, welcome in and thank you for the follow as well. Friends tier list. Oh guys, come on. <laughs> Y'all know Anna is my best friend. There's no number that would ever be big enough. Jordan, yeah, exactly. Exactly. So, I mean, I already, I like my, one of my biggest goals was to go to another event this year. And I, I already just had that happen. So I'm, I'm so happy. I'm just so happy with every single day. No, it doesn't come down to like who's second or anything like that. But no, I've thrown myself into every job that I have, good or bad, or, and it doesn't make a difference. Yes, exactly, Moose, exactly. I always give whatever I'm doing 100%. Um, and that's why I always talk about like whatever, like this is what I'm doing in this moment. It's not gonna be what I always do, but I'm always gonna bring my whole heart and soul to this. I did the same thing with my last one, you know? All right, we need to get started. We're having some deep conversations. <laughs> yes, I'm going to TwitchCon. Um, I don't know if, yes, I, confirmed to have a spot. I don't have my plane ticket because I'm still trying to figure it out. I think I'm going to go see Anna first and then Anna and I are going to travel together. I'm pretty sure. So I think I'm going to be going there first, but yes, yes, we're going to do that. Uh, Tick, what's up? Welcome in as well. And Sultan, in a lot of popular and successful streamers say to be genuine, authentic and have fun. Your thoughts? A hundred percent. A hundred percent. I mean, I think that there's definitely gonna be per personalities and like if that's your shtick, then that's your shtick. But the more you can live original in everything, what you do on your day in and day out, the less you have to feel like it's work. Like I never come on here and feel like, all right, here's another day where I have to pretend. Like just have fun and the rest will come and don't look for instant gratification in this career. Like I feel like too many people are like, I wanna get to the top as fast as possible, but I feel like the faster you climb, the faster you can fall too. So I just been a nice slow burn and I love it. I'm here for it. Hecky, hecky welcome in as well. Oh, Resident Evil remake. I'm about to get back to Leon's playthrough. Speaking of, I'm about to get back to Leon's playthrough and thank you for taking the time to pop over here as well. Um, I'm sad now. <laughs> no, I mean, and also just, just try to remember too that I, I still am trying to create more friendships as well. I don't actually leave the house as much as I would like to. And so that's something that is one of my goals for this year is to make some more friends in other situations and other things. But it also, it making friends takes putting yourself out there. It's not easy to try to become friends with somebody at all. Or like, you just have to get out of your comfort zone, I feel like. I got new animated emote slots planned out. Yes and no, yes and no. I need some more suggestions. What kind of animated emotes would you guys like to see? Yes, Chrono, what's up? Welcome in as well. And Danny, thank you for the follow. So I actually, all jokes aside, I 
I think the best places is, you know, working out if you join like a fitness kind of thing. I had started to make some friends through Pilates, but I think I'm actually going to look for a D&D group. I really would like to join some kind of board game group or something like that and try to make friends through that. I think that's like what's going to be one of my favorite pl like plans for this year. Who would want to do that? All my stuff's here. I also have a bad part of me that even on my off days, I end up still trying to do something that's productive, such as like fixing something in my house, I guess. Yeah, a bruisey. Thank you for the follow and welcome in as well. We are going to start Cyberpunk. Yeah, it's Cyberpunk Tabletop as well. That's why I was... I, uh, part of me wanted to go to PAX East because I have fond memories of playing like tabletop games with people from the community and and just some of my friends and stuff but I think it's a little too close to my birthday did they drop the dates for uh PAX East yet I definitely need more friends it's super difficult at the stage in life yeah how do how do I put myself out there no thanks I'm gonna hide under my blanket Zook that's funny considering what you're gonna be doing soon that's funny uh daniel i've been watching your claire play through all day i just paused to see if you were streaming oh, welcome in uh, so many people popping in from youtube i really cannot express my gratitude enough that you guys are popping over because i know the content is completely different and i just really appreciate it so welcome in and yeah we're doing cyberpunk um and just like i told the other person that came through from resident evil i'll be going back to Leon's playthrough as soon as I'm done with Outer Wilds. I do think I'm coming to the end of that here soon. So yeah, that's going to be happening. But for now, we've got lots of things to do in Cyberpunk. So welcome back. No more blue nails. Did I have blue? Oh, I did have blue nails before. Uh, no, they have switched. I just kind of switched it about. Look, I can only do a bold color and that was bold for me. I can only do a bold color for a little bit of time and then I got to switch it. I got to go back. Let me go back to my comfort zone. <laughs> I can't do it for too long. I know I should do blue nails for blue knees. Yeah, yeah. Also, Zai, thanks for the follow as well. So where are we picking up? We are actually picking up with a main mission. I bought two apartments. No. Oh, no. This is not good. You really? Can we do it at the end of game? Do we have to see what the weapon is now? I feel like that's so jarring for anybody popping in. It's overall Friday. Overall Friday day. I feel like it's so jarring. I don't. <laughs> it's good morning, night city. <laughs> good morning. No. Do, 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 do. The music's so hype for this. It has no business being this good. Woo. Yesterday's body count lottery run it out to a solid just, and sturdy. How can you not like it? Sturdy 30. Mister, thank you. I really appreciate that. Big Mar, let's go. Big Mar's like, wow, that was a long intro. First time here, that was a long intro. <laughs> so different from uh, the YouTube videos where I'm getting... Well, I still ramble at the beginning of my YouTube videos, too. I left us in a cliffhanger. Oh, gosh. Why you guys got to do me like this? All right. <clears throat> I know, I got to go back to the main menu. I got to... <laughs> Colleen Meredith should be the first thing on the agenda. I'm going to get rejected again. Yeah, if you guys are popping in, if you do not know Cyberpunk, um, there's a couple different ways to play it. I'm playing with uh, the nudity turned off, but I did just have my first encounter. I got <laughs> I, I got used and abused. Um, I complimented somebody, told them I wanted to look at their tattoos a little closer. I didn't realize that was code word for sleeping with them. Uh, next thing I knew, I, I ended up in the Notel Motel Holiday Inn and we got this new weapon. And so we have to see what it is. So we need to go back to the, the main. We need to go back to the main menu. <sighs> OK, I'm on. I'm on my way. The things I do for y'all, the things I do for love. Roach race in the apartment. I know. Wait, did you not see this fast? Oh, yeah. Well, that was the biggest. That was the biggest update is we now have an apartment complex with Roach race in it. I know. I didn't even realize that this was a weapon. Although I'm not a stranger because if you've ever played. <laughs> Let me finish. If you've ever played Left 4 Dead, there's lots of mods in Left 4 Dead. And one of them is a pipe bomb that I think is this weapon. Pretty sure. I know, I realize now how that sounded, but in my defense, it makes sense if you've played modded Left 4 Dead, which I realize now is not a, 
It is not held up well. Left 4 Dead 2 is not held up very well. Side note. Oh, well, there it is. How could you guys make me do this? I love Left 4 Dead 2. No, I do. I just feel like going back to it, you kind of have to have those mods. Which I have one that has Jack of Blades on my team, which is awesome. Hello, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. Y'all are so childish. Make me do this. It does need a remake. It needs a third game. <laughs> is this the weapon I think it is? Would would chat be freaking out if it was anything else? Uh huh. I feel like I'm gonna need a new shower after this. Wait, wait, where is it? It's in, it's in melee. It's in melee, I'm assuming. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the anticipation. I always will hear um, Rocky Horror Picture Show with that. What? Did it not save right? I don't... It doesn't change? Yeah. I know, I went back into the main menu and I turned nudity... Oh, I had to turn it on. Wait, but it would have already been on. Hold on. Well, yes, in the base game, yes, I do have nudity turned off. Um, which I'm starting to think that was a good call after the last time. Uh, it wasn't quite as bad as... Uh, God of War. And I also, well, actually that wasn't bad because I got an achievement for it. Where, uh, main menu, sorry. Tracking, tracking. I thought we did do it in main menu. Do you think you can't go back and do it? Uh, they straight up just don't give it to you with the sensor on. So maybe that's what happens is maybe because I got it when it did have the sensor on, it didn't stick. You have to do the scene again to get it. Ryan. Well, shit. You know the drill. Ryan. Yeah, my nudity sensor's turned off. I think you'd have to do the scene entirely again. I'm not doing that scene again. Not with nudity turned off. Not today. No, ma'am. <laughs> no, ma'am. Hecky. <laughs> Heki, <laughs> thank you for the prime sub as well. I can't call her back up. I can't even redo that scene if I wanted to. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without Ryan, thank you for five whole years of asking for Halo. I was actually just thinking of that earlier because I was placing Halo in games I need to play on Twitch. Oh my gosh, Clout. Hi, Dame. Thanks for the follow as well. Wait. No, nudity store. Nu it's the nudity sensor. It's called nudity sensor. So if it's on, then that means it's good. I can't even, if I called her, she wouldn't even answer. You guys know the deal, she doesn't like me. <laughs> I need to push it up on the list. We're gonna do all Halos back to back on my 10 year anniversary. <sighs> it do be like that. It do be. Is there another situation in the game where I could achieve the same, like I could, get the same weapon if I did something else in the game like or do I I'll just watch a video on it I'll watch a video on it there's a similar weapon dot 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 what <laughs> there's a very similar weapon all right so just tell me in that moment before we get the semi-similar weapon floppy pickle on that by the way kiwi hi Big Mar already using the emotes like that. Why you gotta do me like that? Um, <laughs> yes, yes. I can send you the item. It's not a big deal. We'll see. Mevers. Depressed, my, 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 my. <laughs> mil, mil. Actual footage of Vahasta rolling over pedestrians for no reason. My, my, are you talking about Millie? Am I calling her Mai Mai? Oh, the Mai Mai is the official name. 
Oh my god. I all of a sudden feel like, why did I get the jacked up room out of all of it? Why does my- I don't have a single... Jankiest room possible. Members, thank you for 21 months of continual support as well. All right, if there's a few of those weapons that we can get, just remind me before the next one and I'll switch it off. But other than that, in the meantime, where are we headed? I cannot believe I did that. I feel... I just don't feel the same anymore. Ah, the world is changing. Uh, we are going back to Rogue. Right, got it. All right, let's go talk to Rogue, you guys. And we're gonna continue on with the main mission for a little bit. And we need to get more cyberware, but I need to get more money first. AJ with the 100 bits as well. Wait, what was it about Kiwi? And Smithy, thank you for the eight months of continual support. Hello. Hold on, I missed this. I miss this. Kiwi's one of my closest friends. We almost always watch you on a video call. Ah, Kiwi, welcome in. It's the skirt, skirt, the skirt, skirt. In the world of cyberpunk, Casta likes to explore that she reads everything about its lore. I used, I need to, I need to, we need to do a reading session today. Each stream she plays Road to Racing some more because she just wanted to get the final high score. <laughs> and I did, and now I have nowhere else to go. Nowhere left. Nowhere left. All right, my my. Big man doing big man. Millie. Millie. Has my car always been here? I think Millie's always been here. Indecisive. Thanks for the hydrate. I actually just bought myself a Millie in this game. Immediately started. No. <laughs> Hold on. We immediately started hitting people and I started crashing on everything. So it's the car. It's not me. Kiwi, hi. It's so awesome to have you here. I see. And also, DJ, welcome in as well. Been lurking for a while. I wanted to ask about your chair. I recently got the Hayworth Fern as well, and I wanted to get your semi longish term view on it. Ooh, okay. After how much time have I had it for? I think six months? I still love it. Like the day I got it. Everything's held up fantastic. It's been my favorite chair that I've gotten so far. I need to get the big man doing big man things. Um,. I was not, I did a different brand before. I wasn't that big of a fan of it. And this chair just is everything I want. I love that it doesn't have like the detachable head piece. Like I think you can get one that has that. But yeah, this is the, mm, and also surprisingly for having it be a white vegan leather, it's held up extremely well. Like I don't think I've had any stains stick on it that I haven't been able to get off or anything like that. Like I think I've had a couple like smudges from my shoes when I sit like a gargoyle, but I've gotten them off and yeah, it's been great. Why does the car, what are your initial thoughts on it though? Initial feelings and thoughts. I know, I know, but I just need to see. All right, seems fitting for Friday night. I will indulge you guys just this once. Just this once. Mark my words. It's not happening again. PK, hi. Coding Padawan, hi. Moon, I see. Amos with the posture check. And AJ, thank you for the gifted sub to Kiwis. Well, I gotta go. Wait, hold on. I think I need to turn there. No, I'm fine. That will 100% buff out. That will. Is the fern? It is Hayworth's fern chair. Watch out! Woo! Woo! Break! Break! That was actually relatively calm. Inconspicuous high. You saw me put my leg up like a gargoyle, and yet you posture checked me. We'll turn around. We'll go to the right side. Another Millie! And I'll even park. You know what? I'll even park like a normal human. You know what? I'm gonna leave I'm gonna leave not enough space that somebody can park in front of me. But <laughs> not <laughs> but enough that I mess up the person behind me, you know? Like right there. No, somebody could fit another Millie. Hold on. Right there. Nobody can fit. Yeah. Well, let's just solidify. There we go. Yeah. Normal humans don't park like that. <laughs> I 
I think you would definitely fit another Millie stolen friend. Oh, gosh. I think I need to be down below. Shortcake, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. <laughs> Blue, did you say you're sitting on a wooden cardboard chair right now? What is it? <laughs> All right, we got to turn it off. Oh, it's so quiet after. If you drive like that, you can fit a couple more. Just do a few more. It'll 100% buff out. All right, Rogue, you are down below. Bit of a predicament here. She says hey. down. Whoa. Hey. Here we go. Yes. All right. We've never gotten to the bar from this side. Definitely can't fit my F-150 there. That's for sure. It's Lunatic. Thanks for the follow as well. I've loved it so far, Kai. I mean, let me just say I've enjoyed it. It has been a... It's definitely a hard game to play from a lot of, like, the scenarios that happen and the situation and looking forward. Oh! That's what I was going to tell you guys! I watched Dune last night for the... F well, we started to watch it and I fell asleep at a movie night, like, like maybe two years ago in the Discord. But, yeah, I rewatched it and I loved it. But I also haven't read the book. And now I realize I'm, this is perfect timing because the second one's about to come out. But yeah, I actually really enjoyed it. I know a lot of it. It's, it's apparently like a little bit of a mixed reviews on it. Oh. Back to your doghouse. Watch the old one. Jam. Hang on just a little longer, too. No. On the way. No. Read the book. The book is even more amazing than the movie. I would imagine so. I mean, that's the case with almost every book, right? Uh, I think we've had Dune. We've almost read Dune a few times in the book club, but it's never quite made the cut. Yeah. The first book in the series is by far the best one. Yeah, I'm interested to see how part two happens. And yes, I did finish Blade Runner. So I finished Blade Runner. Very interesting movie, just across the board. And also, um, Depp, thanks for the hydrate. Mm. This might be my sci-fi year. Last year was my space year, but this might be my sci-fi year. Read the books. The first six. The rest are crap. There's more than six. They're massive though, right? Aren't they like really thick books? The sci-fi miniseries is the most accurate to the book. I didn't even know there was a sci-fi miniseries. I don't even know why I started watching it. I think it's on HBO and I was just kind of like flipping through. And yes, I am going to finish Edge Runners. I will. Per, uh, per ice, per ice. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in as well. I'm now becoming more of a reader than a watcher. I'm finding myself, I know this is crazy, but after the book club, I feel like I'm more interested in reading in my free time than watching something in my free time. And I've this is like the happiest I've felt in a long time. I can't believe it. My attention span feels a lot longer as well. I'm allergic to books. I started reading Dune and could never get through it for some reason. I need to give them another chance. Yes, 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 yes. Um, I think the yeah it's a little daunting i think when you look at it as an overall series but if you take it book by book i'm sure or even like split up pieces it might not be that bad if this is your sci-fi year you definitely need to play horizon zero dawn it's my favorite sci-fi story of all time i was thinking of that or ghost of tashima for youtube i really was i know we're about to do this main mission and i'm talking about all these other things but long story short i did finish blade runner as well i watched the director's cut i think yeah the, the director's cut uh it left me feeling really just it falls back to it actually reminded me a lot of the whole conversation of the geth in mass effect and i liked that you had to do a lot of your own analysis like i think at the end of the movie i was kind of like wow they didn't really give us a whole lot but then when you think about it for a second they give you so much and you just have to do a lot of the work yourself and I enjoyed that in a movie. I liked that I could just run my brain wild on it without being told what to think in it. There was so much to just read between the lines and I really enjoyed it. And actually, I think it's what androids, uh, do androids dream of electric sheep? Is that what it's based off of, correct? I think we almost read that. We almost read that last year. So maybe we could try to read it this year. Yeah. Yes, she did, Lewis, yes. I have literally read every Doom book, both prequels and sequels. So I guess I'm a fan. What did you think of the new series? Yes, I have played Alien Isolation a ton. I know we're, we're talking all books and stuff. We're about to do this, but 
Uh, I haven't seen the new Blade Runner, but I'm going to watch that next. Yes, I watched the 1982 version with Harrison Ford. Yes, and I think this is the version where he doesn't do the voiceover. I know you guys said there's like 20 different versions, but yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed it. So more recommendations like that, please. But, all right, Rogue, I'm here. Here to see Rogue, expecting me. The book of Blade Runner is vastly different than the movie. Still great though. Yeah, I was actually, I think it's kind of short, isn't it? I remember looking at it on Goodreads before we picked, uh, I want to say that it was going to be, maybe that didn't make the final cut. I think we ended up going with Project Hail Mary instead. But. Hey Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? I love her shirt. Two, please. Make some room. Oh, Sit and down. wait, real quick before I actually go off of Blade Runner, I just wanted to confirm, uh, the character in this game is based off of the um, one of the girls, right? Is based off of the girl, or kind of in looks alike. Uh, Floppy Pickle, yes. Uh, Pris is supposed to look a little bit like the girl who voice is voiced by Jessie, right? I think you guys had kind of mentioned that. Misty, yes. Yes, that's kind of a really cool little little detail. I'm sure there's other things that they have that Blade Runner kind of influenced or they did a little nod to, I'm assuming. Yes, Misty's based on Pris. Very cute homage, yeah. Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. We need to tell her about Johnny. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Yeah, I want to know all the Easter eggs at the end of it. Mm -hmm. Bottle stays. Oh, is that kind of night? Nice? Go ahead, enjoy. Man, I haven't watched uh, True Detective since I tried to watch the second season, but I can't. I, I just loved Matthew McConaughey's first season, and I'll never go back. To your health. Hey, to <laughs> your health. Evaporate. To oh. yours, kid. Gonna need it. Keanu's so pissed he doesn't get a drink. Although maybe he tastes it. Do you think he tastes what I taste? He never said anything quirky about Meredith. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. He should be. Think she'll help? Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Okay. Something tells me she thinks you check out. Okay, maybe I'll try the new season, Double Nova. Let's see what you got. Yeah, Alice, I'm really enjoying. Yeah, this might just Your be sci-fi. Your not on any payroll, not officially anyway. I'm having fun with the genre. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. All oh, the last Kang mission. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Of course he's judging me. I judged me after that. That, that whole situation. <laughs> Can you track him down? Probably keeping him hidden from Arasaka. Mm -hmm. Must have worked on a top secret project. Mm -hmm. Yeah. In ten hidden years, from Arasaka Trouncy. or any other megacorp that wants what he knows. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. So sick. Think Hellman might be in one of them. Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs mm. on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered. It's a really cool, it like, table, intel brief on it. But catch the load on the AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. But a person. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. There you go. Oh, boy, Hellman. That was She's the good, good. News. There it is. Yeah, she did get the intel pretty fast, though. That is true. Data's all what was that, maybe a day? You just snap your fingers and it falls in your lap. I know where to look, and I know whose head to put in a vice. Also, hate wasting time, especially answering stupid questions. Hmm. And the bad news? So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup mm. hustle will be on us. But right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor just outside the city and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess okay. it's your lucky day. Dead zone. 
I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Oh, what kind of person? What sort of gear? I see, I, I hate when I get locked out of those kind of conversation pieces. Boston, welcome back in as well. Oh, Pick did you pace. like, did you like uh, season one, Alice? What kind of gear are we talking? Cruising speed of an AV like that's 250 miles an hour. Ever tried to grab anything moving that fast? Even tracking her will be difficult. Plus, mm. this model packs next-gen defenses. So without real firepower, I'll be able to wave to Hellman as he zips past. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them, or who mm. can at least improvise on a theme. Darks, welcome in, by the way. I do them. I love doing them myself. Uh, except for my my Let's Play channel, I do my own thumbnails. But otherwise, my editor does my uh, archive channel. You're wasting my time. So a native. Sorry. Know any hick marks? And welcome in. Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her we clan anymore. We saw her, right? Anymore, she left last nomad. time. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Tell me, the best Won't people are nomads. Won't have a choice. Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nab and Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got All right. Feeling, Don't work with clan outcasts. Ooh. Strange nomads usually stay clear of city folk. I know we saw we saw Pan Am. She was leaving the Pick last time the, the conversation happened. Your thank you. Yeah, I love making the thumbnails. Mm. Let's do this. Can't be trusted if her clan banished her. Which says something about me. Sorry, just not willing to pay you for help like that. Actually, she walked away. Said it was about the family, Murders. future, nomad ideals, blah, 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 blah. I stopped listening a few words in. Thought you preferred to know who you're dealing with. Johnny does always have enough. a bad feeling. Besides, when someone starts spouting ideals, it's probably about something else. Power, usually. Fortunately, not my biz, not yours. Pan Am's capable and stands to help you. That's all you need to know. Okay, strange. I do want to get all the conversation pieces out of this. The fact that I'm not wearing earbuds, immersion breaking. It seems wonky to me. <laughs> Nomads give the city, city folk a wide berth. Varies by clan, by the connections they have, the depth of shit they're in. But you're right. Alda Caldos are rarely willing to do biz with the city. Pan Am's hmm. got a different take? Yep, on everything, it seems. Seems like a little pain in the butt for her sometimes. Oh, yeah, please, no foreshadowing tips or tricks, guys. I'm kind of surprised by the lack of ring wearing. I mean, I know Johnny has, like, a bunch, but, you know, he's You're got that whole, like, rock my time. star kind of vibe to Why him. Pan Am gotta help me? Bad boy vibe. I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. Oh. She ran into a hitch. Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. I like how Rogue. Guess I can try and her, her, but if we don't know where to look, I mean. We do. I do. Are you gonna play me like Pan Am? Ooh. Her voice is really interesting because I I feel like her position, she could definitely like she Pick doesn't. Up a pace. Okay, sorry. All right. You know what? We'll circle back. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me too. My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron Retreat. and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could end it. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. Fair enough. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. But I feel like everybody's a pawn on her board. For a pawn. No All right, fine. Let me hear what you know. Johnny, Ridge, the eyes Johnny's giving. Outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first, sending you her deeds. Look at it. He's like stalking. Uh, finally, let's get out of here. <laughs> All clear. Right. Thanks. Good luck. Mm. Good luck. Yeah, I feel like she could be a lot more aggressive but her tone and maybe that's what makes her even scarier is her tone feels welcoming but it's not the way she carries herself like she knows she's a badass didn't oh the music dun 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 
Yeah, very like royalty esque. Like she knows she runs this joint, and she's got a lot of people under her. And unlike Meredith, I want to be one of. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, Johnny! Come on, breathe, Johnny. I... All right, I need I need more pills. I do need to get more pills. Oh, are you ready? Yeah, I like Rogue already, but I think also you guys said that that's um. She does voice, she voices a lot of stuff, but she's the voice in Hitman. I think she does sound like a voice from Mass Effect. Somewhere. I know, give me the H, smack the HR complaint on. All right, we need to call Pan Am first and foremost, and then get the deets on where to go next. All right, let's see if there was anything that updated in the journal, Ghost Town. All right, want to track down Hellman. Start at the afterlife. Sure, the place has changed over the years, but one thing will never will. You got a question you just can't shake? Head to the afterlife. I think I did read this whole part, but not Pan Am. Okay. The car disappears after a little bit of time. No, it should be in the parking spot. I don't know if I saw it. Uh, Nai, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. Pan Am is a nomad, although maybe ex-nomad rings truer these days. She locked horns with the family's leader, Sal, and left Al Al Aldecaldo. Aldecaldo. Avocado Nation. Oh, didn't it, that is the one I called Avocado. <laughs> and moved to Night City to try her luck as a merc. Pan Am's life is at a crossroads. One, on one hand, she knows that her life needs to change. It's now or never. On the other hand, burning bridges with the Nomad family where all of her friends are might have been a bit drastic. Yeah. On top of that, Night City doesn't take too kindly to nomads or have patience for people like Pan Am, who are internally conflicted and dream of a bigger and brighter future. Much like myself, we kind of feel one in the yeah. same. Hmm. Yeah. yeah, she's Diana in Hitman. That's what somebody else had said. Yeah. Uh, I think you're right. No, 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 no. I'm just not at the parking spot. We crossed here. We had to cross the way. I'm on the other side. I think my car's on the other side. Yeah, let me see. Good times, hi. Woo! Here it is. Wait, it should have been here, right? Or is it across the way? It's gone. There she is! Woo! Excuse me. Hey, crosswalk. Right away. Alright, there's Millie. Oh, we gotta call her first, don't we? Yeah. Team Pan Am getting crazy. Uh, before we listen to that, hold on. Hello? I know, I know we will. We will listen. No. Hold on. Let me turn it off for a second. We'll get back to Grimes. Got your number from Rogue. V here. Oh, I like her picture on the. Mm -hmm. Hey, Pan Am. Got the your name's kind of cool, Rogue. too. Name's V. Great. Where's that old warhorse want to kick me now? The old war horse. Forget Rogue, I can help you. The merch in your car wanted back. This thing between you and Rogue. Couldn't care less. Got a job for you. Good. But I'm overextended at the moment. With the merch in your I car. I like her voice. Getting him back? I can help with that. The rail freight yard on Benita Street. The one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya. Her voice almost sounded sped up there, though. Did it? It sounded like it was playing at like a 1.5 or something. Okay, where are we headed? We are headed down this way. Whoa. All right, I think we should just take out some of the NYs on the way. Just do like one or two on the route. Yeah, like there's a couple here. So I'm just gonna hit up these five on the way down there. This is how we're gonna do some stuff is whenever we pass certain things, we'll just kind of scoop it up. It sounded almost robotic. She just talks fast. Okay, I can kind of understand that. I guess I have a little bit of patience for that. That's just normal. Panem is spicy. Joe! <laughs> Never chat and drive. This is why I should. That's why I can't look at you guys at the same time. Oh, that's right. Hold on. I need the, um. I do want to hear the, I want to hear the one song that I. Uh... Oh, sorry. Oh, now it's not playing. It's stuck. Dang it. We're going to have to progress main mission wise to hear music again. Mm. Uh, uh, It'll buff out. 
These boots are made for walking? Oh, there's a job near us? No, 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 don't get distracted. Don't get distracted. Or is that what we're doing right now? No, we're still in ghost town. Oh, check the notifications. We can come back, we'll circle back. Pedestrians are like the job was in this game. <laughs> Archangel, thanks for the follow as well. No, I'm not looking. I'm not touching you. I hate when it does this. All oh, the necks are broken. I have been wondering where the airbags are. I don't think there's anything. Yeah. And I'm go. Oh, snap. We need to go over here. Oh, snap. No, I think it was the on ramp. Token, what's up? Welcome in. Hello. For Monday's prayer fruit, welcome in. Thanks for stopping by. And bad mozzarella. <laughs> Thank you for 10 months of continual support as well. There's been no, yeah, not a single, single, ah! Airbag has deployed. Trash generation song. The trash generation, oh, are you talking about on the VODs right now? Are the VODs getting muted from some of the sounds that are playing? This car is not funny. This is a very serious vehicle. I don't know why. Oh my. Oh my, welcome back in. And also Orion, thank you so much for the gift of the token. And token, how are you? Oh, snap. Go this way. Who needs airbags when you're made of metal? Fair point. And also when, oh, there was, I do have a motorcycle, but I'm, I'm trash with the cycle. It looks like a one by one Lego piece. It's a cheese grater on wheels. But I'm telling you right now, it's so easy to wait. Hold on. It's really easy to move around the city in. So I know you guys give this crap, but hold on. We're going to go back here into these assaults real quick. Scoop. Yes. The one song you're trying to play right now is always muted. So you have to you have to wait to switch it. That's why it's not playing right now. Oh. Move that. Right, right, right. It's Millie that really sells it. No, 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 no. Okay, I have to remind myself we're doing very hard. I see, I'm not hearing half of these songs when I was working out yesterday with the playlist. Half of these songs weren't there. All right, ready? I gotta work on doing this, I know. Kill or be killed. I should have assessed the situation first. Kill or be killed. Let's go sniper on this. Backside. All right. Still calling chat cyberpunks. I think there's two left. One through there. I don't think I'll be able to hit him through there. But I can break it. Get the angle on her! Oh, Got always it. sniper for close. That guy's a little beefy boy. No, that wasn't that wasn't on purpose grenade. That wasn't on purpose grenade. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. For once, I actually did mean to throw that grenade. Kill or be killed. All right, we're gonna do three more before we go see our dear Pan Am. I'm assuming just, uh, I like the name choice, but it just instantly makes me think of old world because of Pan Am Airlines. These automatic machines. Uh, I feel like Creed should be able to be played no matter what, but I think there's no way for you to turn on one of the sound alerts without the other ones. I'm over cucumber. Hold on. Let's go back over here. <laughs> and we'll have less green lyrics. <laughs> uh, all right, let's pop into here. Let's just disassemble. You guys know the drill. Disassemble some machine guns. Precision rifle. I do need to look for a good precision rifle. Double barrel shotgun, assault rifle. He died doing what he loved. Leg deck? I feel like I should sell that one weapon. Yeah, 
I sniped a lot of my playthrough. I used most every weapon type. Really? You actually did use a lot of different ones? I think I'm gonna stick with the pistols. The electric baton. No. I'm keeping this katana for the looks. Oh, wait a minute. Different. Gamma is different than alpha. Right, 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 right. Since you play a lot of games with throwable objects, if you throw a baseball, would you throw it like a grenade? This is why I stopped doing the softball last summer, remember? Couldn't be helped. Health warning. Drinking alcohol during pregnancy may adversely affect the development of your penis. The image is not quite matching up with the message, but <laughs> still. Vian, hi. Also, V trip, hi. All right, let me zoom across to here. Uh huh. Matri, hi. Zooming around. That'll buff out. That'll 100%. Look, it buffed out. It was. I. It looked. It wasn't anything about the fetus. It looked more like I thought I was looking at something for. I don't know, just irritable bowel syndrome, not pregnancy. Poles not people, you're right. Poles not people, come on. Hmm? <laughs> Poles not people? Grenade! Can you get away from that? Oh, I'm gonna flatline. I'm gonna flatline from this. No. Me heal up just a little bit. Also, the cops are not helping at all. The cops don't care. It was a general warning. Oh, it was a machine. And then somebody threw it away. That person's gonna kill me. The cops, I see nothing, I see nothing. Okay. Grenade! I see nothing, Schultz. Check your head back out. I'm good! And another one bites the dust. We'll do three more because we're right here. I love how we're doing this now. I really am enjoying doing a little bit as we go from main mission to main mission. There's a chicken in that car. The smallest car seems to just wipe out all life. <laughs> McGuire high. Just a bit of a flesh wound. Tis but a flesh wound. All right, jump across. I think we can just walk here. Let's just walk here. 80 meters that way. Watching you makes me want to play this again. Do it. Do it. You guys said that all with Witcher as well. But also maybe like just find a kind of a way to make it different a little bit. Whether that's maybe going back and reading more lore or trying a different background with a different <laughs> class or something. Was that a solo? Solo dolo? Not a solo dolo. Mm. Nicked him. Have you ever done reading lore? Kenny, come on. Why you gotta do me like that? No, this isn't a mission, Lewis. No, I'm not killing random people, no. These are all the uh, NCPD missions. Retro, hello, welcome back in. I know, well, I, I just prefer the sniper because I truly believe that there's just no better feeling. It depends on the game, too. Like, some games don't have a satisfying... Oh, snap. It'd be so quick. Just quick and easy. Look. If you think about it, there's way less. There's really not that many. Yeah, it's the sound of it. It's, it's not even the sound of it popping the head off. It's... There's a distinct feeling. Okay, we'll try this. Math, has it been 40 months? I mean, obviously, but Math, thank you for 40 months of continual support and welcome back in.
Just a little bit of a killing spree. Okay, we're gonna go take out these three real quickly, and then this whole island will almost be done. El Guapo. Watch out! Get back up! Bambi, get back up! It's the feeling when the bullet meets their head. Psychopath over here. Freaking full blown psychopath. Hold on. I gotta make sure I'm. I gotta make sure I'm. Yeah. I actually think I have to be watching it just because I think it is flagging more. He has a permanent limb now. Hey, you can just get it replaced. All right. It'll buff out. There's a lot more tier four components than I was thinking or just tier four stuff also grave tender thanks for the follow welcome in tiger claws territory just casually strolling down the street with a sniper my milwaukee sniper right yes yeah there's an update coming for it i wonder if it has something to do with the music because i did see that that's why i have to be more cautious about the music i think because i think they were saying that it might not actually be like what they intended to be for streamers it i i think they're just changing something about it or something 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 dark side i reckon we have to go up and in or better yet Let's start with this first. Start with that first. So it's up 35 meters. It's on the move. 15 meter. Okay, it's because I'm getting closer to it. So. Ah. Uh, currently working through Witcher. I think Cyberpunk will be my next playthrough once you're done with it. I think the closer you can play them back to back, the more it'll just feel easier to kind of control. Huh. Like, the outline is very similar between the games, I think. Which is why I feel like I'm picking up on this ten times easier than when I was playing Witcher. Witcher seemed like a fire hose because I just didn't understand how they kind of structured everything. Melee finishers are also completely broken right now, so they're probably fixing that. It's interesting that certain things are still overpowered. I guess they try to change something and then they have to alter it again. It's like League of Legends all over again. Just gotta do some stuff real quick. Okay, I'm just gonna take out, these are the last two and then we'll go back and see Pan Am. Well, this one's on the way and that one's kind of on the way. So yeah, 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 Mmm, spurious, I know. I eat cake, welcome back in as well. You should do, oh, you could give a break between them by doing Red Dead first and then you could come back to it's this way. I'm, oi. You could do a break. That's a wombo combo, like Witcher back to back with Red Dead and then Cyberpunk. I don't think your year, I mean, unless maybe you finished with Baldur's Gate. I don't know if you could have a more legendary year or Mass Effect. Yeah, we're gonna go to Pan Am. Math comes back, Pan Am. What? Look both ways. Woo! I like damaged ballistic mask. Oh, I said it was bro. Okay, I see what you mean. I got you. I got you. Is this for clothing? Am I planning the next three years of streaming right now? No, no, no. I played most of those. Do I always know what I think I'm going to play next? Absolutely. That was just disrespectful and dirty, but amazing at the same time. might be it that was that was just a ruthless assassination there was no reason to do that cross station and also ed b guys thanks for the follows welcome in respectful dirty and amazing at the same time <laughs> oh my goodness 
I, I am making Pan Am wait. You know why? Because I, I, I dangled in front of her and now I'm just going to wait. All right. I can't just run into her arms with arms wide open. I have to leave her wanting more, even though she doesn't know what she's wanting because I haven't seen her, but leave her interested. I'm going to hack into this. I need to start getting these. Before you guys say there's no point to it, it's giving me street cred and net running points. All right. All right. All right. Which song? Far Cry 6 also goes hard. Definitely recommend it. Far Cry I've heard a lot and a lot of you guys have been recommending Mafia. I also think with how much I'm enjoying this, going back and doing a GTA 5 playthrough wouldn't be so out of the question. Plus, I feel like in that game, you guys can't shame me as much for mass lottery and pedestrians. We have one attunement point, so I think we were going into... We did get a point back. Uh, cool. Oh, yeah. We're trying to get cool to 15 so that I can do Deadeye. And I actually have a lot of perk points. Yeah, Mafia. She saw your face on the call. <laughs> Yeah, but you know what I mean? It's like, she doesn't know my personality yet. I gotta, I gotta woo her that first. Uh, also, as Enkyo, guys, thanks for the follows and welcome in. Oh, uh, what do you think about Outer Wilds? I was thinking of playing it. Oh my goodness. You, if anybody here is thinking about playing a game, if you want a thought-provoking game that will probably haunt you until you do like 10 playthroughs and haunt you in a good way, play Outer Wilds. Like, I can't quite compare it to any other game I've played. It is both infuriating and incredible at the same time. I think I can see why so many people love it and are just so strongly opinionated about the game. I completely understand, but I definitely recommend it. I couldn't get into it? Really grim. I think if you like space, it's a, do you like, like, I don't know. I just, it felt very magical at the same time. It makes me feel like a kid again, I guess. Really? A lot of you guys couldn't get into it. Interesting. What was it particularly? Was it like the... I, I speed ran Outer Wilds? The only game you ever have, actually? Yes, Jamar. Yes. Um, not so much Persona. I haven't been looking at Persona as much as Yakuza. Yakuza? I don't think I'm actually pronouncing it right, but uh, Yakuza 0, I've heard really good things about. I'm just probably going to take a break from doing super long games after FF7. I would say don't expect me to play like a super long game for like a couple games after. Slippy Toad, hi, by the way, by the way, by the way, by the way. Mm hmm. Anna's love for space is growing on you. I think I was really getting into space before that, though. Uh, like all jokes aside, I I've always been into space. I just last year was kind of my space year. I've had it in my library for a while and started it recently because of the VR mod. I didn't realize they did a VR mod for it. Interesting. Light, by the way, welcome in. Light. Light. I'll never hear the name Light without thinking uh, Death Note. Why can you stay calm for once? I got my FF7 tattoo today. And put in the Discord 12 hours in the chair. I'm dead. Wait, is that the one that was posted? Of There was, I already saw one tattoo, but is there, since I last started streaming? Is that the one with Cloud on top and Aerith on the bottom? Darth Villain, hi, by the way. I adore space. I think last year was space, this will be sci-fi. I just didn't know if I was really into space games like I did before. I know I've always like enjoyed it, but it hasn't been something that's alerted me. Like, I, I just haven't been drawn to it as much as medieval times. Again, I just want to make bread in a hovel and die at my first flu that I catch, you know? That's, I'm okay with that. Focus is active shooting grenades out of the air. I told you guys you could shoot grenades out of the air and y'all were like, me, me, me. I'm gonna do rise, 10% reload speed for your next reload after neutralizing an enemy wall. That's actually useful for me, especially with the sniper mod. Uh, one reaction vid to GTA 6, one of them almost, wait, wait. What was this? Try playing Space Quest? Okay, hold on, hold on. This is like when you guys are like, Space? Star Citizen? What? Hold up. Hold up. Uh, I think my love is really just strong narrative games. I don't think it really quite matters what the genre is anymore. I think, well, not the genre is strong narrative, but I guess the aesthetic doesn't matter as much as just a beautiful story that can make me feel connected to the game. Yeah. 
Also, Jen and Ev, guys, thank you for the follows as well. Next year could be Persona. I think that's the only reason why I haven't really given those an option or I guess a second look. It's just because they're really long. Like a lot of them are pretty long. Out of Wilds is hard to get into because of space. Really, Knack? I wonder why I was so captured by it. I don't know what it was specifically. Um, gosh, I think I'm a sucker for that kind of art style. I would say, pull it out of the sky. Head to head when focus is active, neutralize an enemy with a range attack. Recess duration. I actually want to go over to our medical section. Not hack you. Oh. Not hack you. Technical abilities, field medic, faster percent of health items in combat. Max grenade charge. That's what we wanted. Yes, demolitions. We need to go, uh, we need to go do some EOD today, too. Persona has some of the best narrative games for sure. But they're really long, aren't they, Jay? I mean, I could be misjudging that completely. And also, too, welcome in to Claude. I recently found out about your channel. I've been watching all the Last of Us episodes. It's so great. I played that such a long time ago, it feels like. It'll be coming up on two years in July or I guess September. I guess it hasn't been that long. To Claude, thank you so much for popping over from YouTube. And I'm glad that you've been enjoying the stuff over there. I hope you enjoy it just as much over here as well. I had to get it before rebirth. So it was, it was that one dart that looked so sick. You have your ship waiting to claim in Star Citizen. I know, I know I do. I'm gonna do one, I'll do one. I've told Anna before I'll do a crash course in Star Citizen. Like I'll do a day where I pop in and she can show me around. Yeah, Persona is super long. That's not unappealing to me, but I have, a, I kind of have a limit on long games that I'll play for YouTube just because I don't get through games as fast. You know, it's two hours max. The last, like, if you think about it, FF16, I don't know if anybody, I don't know if anybody counted up all the hours for that. I don't even know how many hours I put into it, but I ended up pushing for like two or three hour episodes because it was getting to be so incredibly long. EVE Online, no. I was also looking at Path of Exile today for some reason because I own it and I was looking at it. That's kind of what I'm thinking about now, especially since I'm getting into space bag lately. JJ, Outer Wilds, it'll change your life. Uh, it truly, it's this mystery. It's, it's a, uh, I like Outer Wilds because I can't put it into a single box. I can't, yeah, I can't put it into a single, like if, it is very rare nowadays for me to play a game and not feel like it has a lot of strong representations of other things or maybe influences. Like a lot of times you'll play a game and you're like, oh, this feels heavily influenced by this, this, and this. I cannot pinpoint it with Outer Wilds. I almost think that it just is its own thing. It really doesn't feel like I can compare it to anything else. I haven't done the DLC. No, 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 I haven't done it yet. I know there is a DLC. Path of, yeah, Diablo. Diablo-esque or something. I want to try a game like that this year. All right, let me talk to you guys while I'm doing these because there's one more. So a lot of people say to do this. We're going to do this and then we'll hightail it back. A lot of people say to do Subnautica after Outer Worlds. Good luck playing, Pewee. I don't know if I'm actually going to. I think, uh, but I want to play some kind of game like that this year. I want to just try it. Yeah. Also, Darth, have a good night. Thank you so much for stopping by. And absolutely, did you do a tap out session or you just said you did eight hours? Millie. Oh, I didn't order Millie. Millie Rock? Ah. Uh. Oh! <laughs> Millie does not like me using other vehicles. Look, Millie is a jealous girl. And that's okay, all right? That's okay. She's crazy, but the best ride I've ever had, I'll tell you that much. All right, let's get out of here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, her AI is changing. Her AI, she's <laughs> The crazy ones are all, oh. <laughs> Holy cow, she's actually starting to sh Oh! Or maybe she's just pissed by all the wrecks I've gotten her in. I'm gonna start driving her more carefully now that I know. Next- You already know. The next thing I do, she's like, I'm sorry, Casta. I cannot do that. Oh, oh, oh. Stop. There we go. All right, let's hit this one. I, I know, I know. 
<laughs> a lot of personality in that one. What can I say? I love to watch her go. Wait, I hate to see her go. I'm going to kill you now. But I love to watch her leap. The reload time. Oh, that's a random person. That's a random person. Not somebody I can kill. <laughs> That'll do. That'll do. I might try it whenever I can. Yeah, I mean, also, Outer Wilds, it can be... It... Uh, I'm not... I, there are things that I'm going to miss in my first playthrough. There are things that I will always miss. That... Oh, wow, that entire Outer Wilds conversation? I was thinking of Starfield? No, no, Outer Wilds is different. Um, I'm cognizant that I, I'm going to miss no matter how meticulous and I can be as focused on the game as possible, right? And I'm going to miss things. It's just, it's human error. It's also a first playthrough. It's just going to happen. But if there is any game that I say to give the most amount of time you possibly can and just try to take it slow, it's that game and read everything. Uh, what am I doing? I'm disabling. Millie, Millie Rock. Uh, yeah, we're, we're gonna be driving her very carefully going forward. I know, I do feel like the headshots are on point today. It's kind of making me want to get back into COD, but not really. I don't think I want that toxicity in my life. I think I'm fine. Ditch that, ditched, uh, I can keep the Iconics. Man, I need to find a better Liberty. Why am I still getting tier ones? Absolutely you. Absolutely. Um, I do have it. This year, I will go back to a Life is Strange. I, I can actually say that with certainty. I do want to go back to I think Life is Strange too. I think. Yeah, you don't feel alone. Well, actually, there are a lot of times where I do feel extremely alone, but also not alone. That game just gives you so many powerful mixes of emotions. Uh, double barrel shotgun. Also, Bell, what's up? Welcome in. Destiny 2, I... No, don't do this. No, I can't, I can't drop that because... All right, let's go back over here. I do, I like the gunsmith system and yeah. All right, we're gonna scoop to whoop this and then head over to Ghost Town. We've left her waiting long enough. Millie, Bobby, what are you doing? It'd be amazing to hear me crap talk on con. Wait. Oh, history. I'll leave it on the station, but I think it's gonna get locked out. Tarkov? Oh, this voice again. Yeah, I was trying generic high, by the way. I, uh, I was trying to decide between Into the Storm or just Life is Strange 2, but I think I had hands down most people Wait, did you say you just finished Life is Strange 2 30 minutes ago? AJ! Wait, 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 wait. I think I said to Kiwi that I couldn't wait for you to play Life is Strange 2, like 30 minutes ago. Thank you for the 100 bits, by the way. Um, yeah, that that was the most required. That and Ghost of Tsushima were the top two most recommended games that you guys wanted to see from me when I polled uh, on Instagram. So I think I would do two before Into the Storm. So, why am I driving so well? Feels weird. How did you enjoy it, Drash? What'd you think of it? And Dream Hunter, hi. <laughs> Dream Hunter, thank you for, is it three months? It's only been three months. One ticket to Night City? I think we can do that. I think I can make that happen. I think I just stopped going 90 miles per hour and all of a sudden I became a better driver. Hmm. <laughs> you really liked it. I do want to play, I do want to play Hogwarts at some point. I just haven't... It's, um, okay, this is going to sound strange. It's like that game that you know you're going to enjoy, so you just keep it on the back burner because I'd rather try games that I are going to make... Um, it's like the tried and true. It's like something that you know is there, but you're going to test out... Oh, this is a compound! This is a compound! A compound! 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 <laughs> Uh, right, I should have thought about this. Hey, go fuck yourself. Like, you know you're gonna enjoy it, so you're like, alright, I'll come back whenever I feel a little bit more downtime. It's not gonna give you the same rush that another game is gonna give. You know, like, when I 
when I put on FF7, not expecting to like it, and then all of a sudden finding it to be one of my all-time favorite games, that was the biggest rush I've gotten in a long time. It made you feel again. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm gonna die. I don't think this is something we should do in this exact moment when we're trying to wait for Pan Am. So we'll, uh, we'll circle back. Circle back. True Colors is the sole reason why I've been considering Denver, Colorado. Transfer from college. I, yeah, I don't know anything about what it's about. Also, Ice, thanks for the follow. And Belle, thank you for the follow. I'm glad to see you enjoying your time here. You've been doing that with Red Dead, too. Red Dead 2 is like a tried and true game. You know you're gonna love it no matter what stage in life you're at playing it. Harry Potter, it's, I, I've loved Harry Potter my whole life. It reminds me so much of my childhood and a magical time period. I mean, it's literally magic. So I feel like it's the game that I'm gonna reach for when I'm going through a hard time or something. Like maybe I need a pick me up or something. I just need to, feel a little bit better. It also could be one of those kind of games that I'm wondering, no, oh, it's probably not one of those games that we play every once in a while. I said I wasn't going to do it, but now I've been shot and killed and I need to get back my dignity. So hold on. Yeah, Grim. I doubt it would take us that long. Oh, no, trust me. Oh, here we go. Nostalgia, powerful thing, but I don't feel like I lean for it to enjoy a game as much as I used to. I'm starting to believe in Saltonius, welcome in as well. Going back to, I would love to go back to OG Red Dead. Uh, I'm starting to realize that, you know, I think sometimes we put a little bit, look, nostalgia is a powerful thing. I get it. I love it. I, I have it with a couple things, but I'm starting to realize that there's, I almost enjoy playing a game more now, getting to experience it with where my brain is at now more than even with nostalgia. I think nostalgia just has this like rose colored glasses like look on it, but I'm starting to realize that I enjoy discovering games at this stage in my life more than going back and playing games that I used to have such a fond memory of. The rush of finding a new game mixed with, I would have never looked at that. I, 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 that's why I do like going back to those games too though, is I can bring like a new analytical style to it. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, Knack. Yeah. I love, I love the nostalgic games. Don't get me wrong. I really do. I need an attribute point too for that. But there's like this new rush I'm getting from discovering new types of games I love and I'm getting a different sense of joy. Like I'm finding a different kind of joy from them. I still can't believe I pulled the Pokemon. Guys, I know I, I need to start pulling these Pokemon. But yes, I know. I know, I know, R. Kelly. I know, I know. <laughs> I'm pulling the Pokemon packs without you guys. Um, if I can, so I couldn't find the latest thing at Target today, but if I can find a box, maybe we'll open some together. But I don't really know, but I don't know the new Pokemon. I knew 151 Pokemons, so it made more sense. But um, the new range is like, I don't know any of them. But I'm, I'm down to like learn. It's fun to come back to something nostalgic every now and then, but it's great, yeah. But I can't stay on the nostalgic you know, coping. It's like, hey, I want to. Oh, he didn't see us. Come along. You know what? We're going to hop up here. Hop a squat. He's spawn camping. Yeah, there's, there's way too many Pokemon to keep up with now. Eyes on. Chat will jinx you. Oh, I knew that was too good to be true. All right, it's happening. No, no more stealthy I threw. I could have had it all. Rolling in the deep. Ooh, rooftop? There's a rooftop, I think. No, it's, um, I keep thinking they're not what I think they are. They're, um, it's for hack. No, wait, maybe it is. No, I think it's for hacking. I think it's for hacking. Uh, I played Soma, I need to play, I need to go back and replay Soma. Soma got done dirty. Soma I played during, uh, there's a guy behind me or something. 
Uh, so my play during 12 games of Christmas, and so it got done a little dirty. Let me see if I can make him... Oh, I should have done robotics malfunction. Yes, it's pretty short. I want to go back and replay it for um, YouTube. No, there's not a sniper. No. Oh, there is sniper. Yeah. I see. There's actually... Oh, you know why? Because I forgot that sometimes they try to snipe you through... Oh, they try to snipe you through objects. So he's behind the thing, but I can't see him because he's not popping his head out. Yeah. But there's definitely one more up there. Yeah, you can see him. Well, he's behind it, but... Sniper's chat trying to troll me right now. Marky, hi. Uh, Soma, but you know what we need to do before we go back to Soma is, uh... Dead Space 1. Also, Van and Az, guys, thanks for the follow. I was not gonna hit that. Ooh. Are you the lat? Thank you for making the call out for me. It's good to know. He's also an invisible last man standing. Never mind. He was just crouched. Yeah, I need, I, I'm trying to decide if I should do the remake first. Because so far, wow, it's so nice of him to line up. So far, I've been doing mostly originals and then I go back. What a time. Wow. Well, he died holding what he loved. I feel like I usually do the original first and then go back to the remakes. Is there somewhere? Yeah, absolutely, too, Claude. Yeah, if you're not in the Discord, uh, feel free to suggest it even in here. Uh, my mods will write it down. There's like this all-encompassing suggestions list, or if you are in the Discord, you can just drop it in the suggestions. Oh, I'm over cucumbered. Yeah, we have this all-encompassing list. It's massive. One day. I want to see another playthrough of Wolf Among Us. The first one was good, but I'm sure the second one will be... Yes, yes. We don't talk about the first one. Also, look at this gun that is bigger than me. He was doing the Michael Jackson. <laughs> look at this revolver. No, wait. Why did I just place that on? Blah. Blah. This 100%. Uh, whenever they get, Whenever we get closer to seeing Wolf Among Us 2, I'll go back to it. Yeah. Also you, thank you so much for the kind words. I appreciate it. I'm glad that you're enjoying both this side and it sounds like YouTube as well. Uh, tier two. What was my baby that I had on before? The Lexington? I wanna try the new. This is a three Lexington, so I'm gonna disassemble that. Double barrel shotgun can go. Precision rifle, we should. Achilles, I don't know. I'm kind of happy with my sniper over the precision rifle. I also need to store this in Millie. Remind me to store. The scalpel. We should try using it just for the... Yeah, do you think you'll ever try out Pal World off stream? I w Uh... Oh, sorry, uh, my brain, <laughs> my brain, hold on. I've got like 20 things running around in my head. Uh... We could try it on stream. How is Horizon Zero Dawn not on your suggested games list? It should be. I. Oh, uh, so the second one's probably on the suggested, but if the first one's not on there, it's because it's on my need to complete playlist. Drop this. Um. Yeah, it's on my. Am I serious? What is chaos? You mean to be so? Uh, Rex row. Rex row. Welcome in. It is. No, I just need to drop this damn thing. And I don't wanna hear the good side. How do I drop it? Drop it. Do I just need to switch what? There we go. There we go. You just have to switch weapons. Uh, it's on my unfinished list because I started it. I hunted a bunch of turkeys and then I never finished it. It was like a long time ago. Yeah, so I was thinking what I would like to, wow. A lot of electric batons, which I'm wondering, were those actually batons? Was this time, were they actually batons this time, guys? Holy knives. Uh, we could try Pal World on stream. I'm kind of leaning towards just because I really do like playing these like cutesy, cozy, fun games off stream. I'm thinking I'd like to start doing like seven of whatever, seven streams of whatever we're main playing. And then maybe like every eighth stream, we try a, try like a cozy game. 
So maybe by Monday, maybe Monday this week or Thursday this week, we could try Pal World. We could try that or we could try um, Sims. We could try any of them, really. I do, Castling. I do. Pretty much anything. And also, I'm not just blowing smoke up y'all's butts. Like, I, everything that you guys are suggesting, I've thought about, I want to play. And I'm going to try my hardest to get to. Some of them are more prioritized than other ones. Like, Telltale Batman is actually one I'd like to get to this year. But more importantly than the Telltale Batman, I really would like to get back to finishing the Batman games, period. Also, Jules and Ez, guys, thanks for the follows and welcome in as well. Crunchy weenies, where are they? The milk boxes. Night City filled with batons. Special batons for non-lethal games found on Jig Jig Street. Have we still not gone to Jig Jig? I think that's it. I think we still haven't. I wouldn't say Pal World is cozy. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna snag this on the route. I actually know what. Uh, but then you would snag that. I mean, we might as well grab that and then that and then we'll get there. And then I'm done with NCPD for the day. Then we're done for Friday. That's the last end. Those are the last two NCPDs for now. For today. Stupid. It's actually. It's really nice to just do them on your route to a main mission. And I don't feel like it's pulling my focus from the main mission, even surprisingly. And it's like a nice way to break them up. You can customize all the settings. I did see that you can add them one of the old Pokemon games. That could be kind of fun. We could do that. We could do do Fable. We could go back to Fable. Millie. Millie Rock. Make sure you keep some games for yourself. Absolutely, Alice. Uh, Fay Farm will always be that for me. Fay Farm's like that for me and Stardew Valley. Those are my two cozy games that are just for me. But like all jokes aside you guys make games like 10 times better and more enjoyable so i i very rarely am gaming in my off time these days anyway but there's still a couple that i already i have there's i mean i just look on steam and i find like five new games to add every single time another compound right right skelliga the question marks in Skellige, yes, yes, Dresden. Remember how I was with that? <laughs> Remember that? Newt! Wow, you managed to find the coolest car in the game. I can't go a single stream without somebody making fun of Millie, and it's just disrespectful. I mean... <gasps> There's a lot of things that can be said about me, but you can never look at my car and say I'm overcompensating. In fact, I'm trying to let people's expectations be super low. <laughs> I need... Oh, bad news bears. There go. Nice. He's not dead. They saw me. Snap, crackle pop. I hate when they don't go down in one single shot. <laughs> did you say, did I just kill somebody innocent? I'm not even going Netrunner. Reboot optics, cyber remote function. Grenade out. Me, sure. Figmar. I have three grenades now. Oh my gosh. It's really past buying out here. Oh my goodness, Baz! Baz, almost an entire year. Witcher 3, baby. Baz, thank you for almost an entire year and a tier 2 this whole time. Thank you. And I don't want to keep good. Why is that song stuck in my head? This damn song. I swear. Pape. Thank you, Pape. Pape with the gift of sub to Cool Car and also Matt and Kennedy. <laughs> Uh, Kennedy and Matt, guys, thanks for the follows. Pape, thank you for the gifted sub. Uh, uh, yes, Billy, I will be going to TwitchCon Europe. Yes. Guys, it's okay. Relax. Relax. All right, let's pick up the item. 
Yes, we already got our Airbnb. It's super cute. I'm so excited. Um, I think I'm going to go for a couple days before and just do some traveling first. Okay, which one is a cozy game? Which one? Oh no, oh no, oh no. I definitely killed some innocent. Uh, that guy wasn't innocent. Not at me. Not at me. Not at me. Something is weighing me down more than this clothing items. I bet you clothing items. If I had to guess, yeah, I've got a lot of legs. I got a lot of legs. <laughs> Matt, I discovered you through your Outer Wilds playthrough. There's been a bunch of people that have been popping in from Outer Wilds. Welcome in. Um, yeah, there's quite a few people that have popped in today. Thank you so much for coming over from YouTube. And I hope you enjoyed the live side of things. Chillin' hi as well. Oh, I was just talking about that. I feel oh, I'm, 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 I'm nervous for the next couple episodes. All right, let's see. I got a lot of legs I gotta drop. Backpack. Oh, maybe it's my drink obsession. This is like my desk. This is my desk at home. Here. <laughs> um, it is in, it's close to Amsterdam. Rotter, 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 Rotterdam. I thought it ended with dam. Damn. Too many energy drinks in the backpack. Oh, snap, crackle pop. Um, all jokes aside, Matt, thank you so much. And yeah, I hope you enjoy. Have you ever played Cyberpunk? It's quite different. We were just actually having a discussion about Outer Wilds a little bit. I don't have legs. I know it's crazy. We need to craft some more things, by the way. I need to get a new chip. That's priority is new chip. Upgrades, but to the backpack. I need to drop something. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Junk. Junk. All right. Uh, oh gosh. This would take so long to disassemble the junk and it wouldn't even free up that much space. What is taking up so much space in my inventory right now? Probably a lot of this stuff. I need to sift through this, don't I? You know what? Uh, floppy pickle, but I'm assuming these don't take up weight. Mods. I think it would just be weapons and clothing, I think. I haven't played much yet, but been blasting around in Outer Wilds. It's so much fun. I was just, it's so much fun. Do you like space to begin with? Oh, or sorry, wait, you said uh, you just bought Cyberpunk? These things don't add weight. Right, okay, correct. I think that was similar to Witcher 3, right? Mods didn't do that. Only weapons and clothing, which means... Okay, yeah, I might be a hoarder in hindsight. Yes, oh. Oh, you know what we need to get rid of? Ugh. Disassemble. What else? What else? What, are they? what else was it? What were the shoes? It was my favorite cowboy boots. It was my favorite cowboy hat. I got to get rid of that. Oh, where are the cowboy boots? I got to ditch him. Oh, no. What else? What? <laughs> you can see if you have something in the weight description. Oh, the weight description of the item. I'm also just going to go by things that I don't really need. Or maybe I should just store in Millie. Got it. I'm going to store in Milia too. I'm over cucumber as a physics teacher, so Outer Wilds is extra cool for me. That's something that I... <laughs> I guess I never looked back and was like, I wish I had paid more attention in certain classes. But when I got to Outer Wilds, I was like, I, I really wish that I had more, I guess, more knowledge about space and more aspects of it because I think that it's not something that's necessary for Outer Wilds, but it probably makes it more enjoyable. For me, I was like, oh, but also I guess that that's why I'm also wide eyed and bushy tailed at everything. I'm so excited and like, oh, this is amazing. What is this? Mm. Where? Right, right, right. Let me just down. Let me just drop one of these, by the way. I see. Oh, a sapphire. I thought it was Sephiroth. I was like, what? Uh, let me just drop these assault rifles, too, because they probably are pretty heavy. We're going to deal with inventory management here in a second. I'm going to have a feeling everyone had at the end of Avengers Endgame. Oh, no. Here we go. No. Also, London, thank you for the gifted sub to Matt. Matt, you're stuck now. I hate to say it, but just like Big Mar, Big Mar popped in, too, from Outer Wilds today, and y'all are just stuck. So I hope you guys like Cyberpunk, because we're here for a while. I've been disassembling, Durr. I wasn't dropping, I've been disassembling. Unless I just accidentally pressed the drop right there, but I thought I had been. Uh, do you think I'm not gonna get those free engineering points from disassembling? I'm sorry. Do you think I'm not? Uh, you're talking to the girl that spent an hour 
in the fields with the mines and they call it a mine. Juan, thanks for the follow sector as well. And London again, thank you so much. I don't know though, I don't know if they should thank you because now you're getting them stuck. Millie? Unhinged on Fridays. Unhinged. <laughs> She's learning. She's adapting. She's about to be going to Delamain's. This is what happened to Delamain's others. They what jumped into Millie. Let's go ride in Night City. We'll just go to Pan Am. I don't need to do this other one. Actually, I might just yeah, it's fine. Never mind. We're already here. Oh, this is my favorite part of it. How much sitting? Wait, wait, wait. Did you ever hear the song? Remember how much sitting this one out? Wait, what do you mean? Okay, we're just gonna kill some people to this song real quick. Somebody's killing me right here. Oh, snap. It was almost clean. See, my pistols aren't keeping up with my sniper. My sniper is just doing so much more damage than everything else. One more, one more. Shoot, shoot. Hold on. I need to start doing this anyway because I need to get those points for Netrunner. Flanking. Flanking. All right, one more in the backside. I'll gladly be a house husband for Pan Am. Wow, I just got welcomed back into my gym. Pop your head up. All right, that will do. Yeah, that was quite the contrast between the song and that, yeah. No, crazy, I haven't finished it yet. I know, I can't even say anything about it because I've been finishing a bunch of other things before finishing that. No. I wanna mod out the sniper even more though. It's not good enough. Cyberpunk never clicked for me, it felt too clunky, really? This song, and then there's the other song we listen to at night that just, now I will always think of cyberpunk from it. They archive conversations, Durr and... Oh yeah, Durr, thank you for the follow. I'm glad you've been enjoying your time here. We must have never played a Bethesda game. <laughs> I'm carrying too much, I know. It was a gym bop. It was, thank you. Like, it's sad. If you listen to lyrics, it'll feel really sad. But, uh, oh no, we're feeling heavy from, uh... <laughs> I'm really feeling that, uh, that death again. Jackie's hitting hard right now. It was actually a pretty good gym, Bob. And what can... <laughs> Tier 1, get rid of... Tier 3, Kenshin... This is, or, sorry, Omaha. Yeah, I've never been a fan of the Omaha. Lexington we already have at a higher rate, so we can just ditch that. And this is the Nova. Let's try it. Tier 4 Nova. It's a revolver though, but I'm not opposed to it. Oh, this one. This is it. Yeah, this is the other song that I just feel like those two songs are Night City. Yeah. There's a purple here. Purple. Oh, I don't know what it's called. I guess I should look at it. Jack in. Second best song. What's the first one for you? If you say Pon Pon, you're gonna say Pon. Millie's model is a reference to the Fiat. Oh my gosh, of course. 
Of course. Is this one called Suns? Oh. All right, we'll get back to it in one second. So I'm going to walk you guys through this. Also, when you guys see me fail this, do not spoil this for me. All right, guys? I'm telling you right now. So I'm going to go IC to 7A because I want to hit the expert data mine first, which means the next one I need to do in this variation would be 7A, but then I think I'm going to lose out on the other ones. I think, no, that's perfect. But now I need to do 7A to push it back. And then I can now, oh, I didn't read ahead to E9, so now I'm going to miss that no matter what. Yeah, I had to look ahead for a little bit. I drive a Fiat 500. I actually, like, I maybe that's why I'm drawn to Millie is because I drive something quite opposite in real life. It's because I'm not playing Sandstorm. <laughs> Rocky! Rocky, thank you for three months and welcome back in. All right, guys, let's go see Pan Am. I need to turn around. Also, we need to set the mood. Hold on. Hold up, hold up. If I was driving a smart car. <laughs> I'm just going to wait for a second. Crafting hacker that I just got from Dad. I'm like, no, not yet. I haven't been looking at that stuff yet. After we do Pan Am, I'm going to work on crafting some things. You said puzzle. And I thought pizza. And it's Friday. Some Papa John sounds so good right now. Millie makes her own mod or her own roads. That's true. Uh, I don't think I can go through the concrete there, but. Sounds like one of the um, one of the singers from the soundtrack of Fifty Shades of Grey, actually. You have pizza for dinner? What kind? There is pizza on your focus. Pocus, pocus. There's pizza on your focus. Oh, that was nice. She's gonna be mad about that one. We, look, I'm just saying that if there's anybody I want to see their tattoos up close and personal, it's, uh, ma'am, ma'am. Spicy ramen. Why do I feel like I've been, like, taken back to Transformers all of a sudden? Megan? Hey. Pan Am? So you're V. Where's my car? Jerd, no, thanks for the follow. What's wrong with this one? Why does it matter? What's wrong with this one? It's borrowed. It's not mine. I asked where my car is. Hmm. I'm not gonna bring up Rogue's name. Well, maybe I need to name drop. No. <clears throat> not my style. Agree to help me, you'll find out. Oh, fuck no. You will not jerk me around. Tell me where my car is. Oh, snap. Can you look me in the eyes when you're talking to me? The hell's your problem? Fuck me, you always on the warpath? Only when someone tries to jerk me around. Where the hell is my car? I tell you, and then what? Gonna storm off, handle it all by yourself? That is no concern of yours. None. No, Crate, no. You need me sooner. You accept that, the better. Listen to me. Listen to me. You need my help. And you'll get it. I mean that. Right after we solve my problem. Fine. Say it. Oh, what do you want? She is kind of looking like Megan Fox a little bit. Not really, but... Need her help hitting convoy. Gotta get this one guy at this one. Need to hit a Kangtow transport. Won't be easy. Wanna know I can count Plus on you. Plus, you need to get back in the Are good you out of your goddamn mind? About you or the job? Top high. Kangtow's AV route will take it over Jackson Plains. Heard that should help us. Yeah, I doubt it. Gonna be a guy on board. Need to talk to him. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help oh. in getting back what's yours. We got a deal. Oh my gosh, V's voice is so good. I don't know. I... Shit! Oh, I thought it was Millie beeping at us. Yeah, she definitely needs a All car. Right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. Thornton? So where is it? That's the type of car, right? That's one of the types of cars? Uh-huh. <laughs> 
<laughs> London, thanks for the gift of to Sir Whale. Sir Whale Nips, welcome the? back in. Oh, sorry. I thought this was mostly about the merch. Fuck the merch. With that ride, I can take any transport job in town. Without it, the only thing I can move is nice. pizza. Maybe. Amazing VAs in this. Cars in Rocky Ridge. Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirty eating bastard. I will strangle you. Who's Nash? Nash, a tomb of yours. He hang you out to dry. Do not call him that. Fine. This one, Tab? Partner. Former. If ever. The shift tricked me. He straight nipped my truck and the merch. Oh. Probably now aims to sell it off in Rocky Ridge. Is he ever going to be fucking disappointed? The detailing, plus I love her freckles. I like her jacket too, the jacket's sick. Rocky Ridge, let's go. I wore no whole fit. I, I, I should think this through. You need time to think it through? Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Wanna tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince okay. them to leave the bastard hanging. You know, she's too cool for me. I feel like uh... back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Oh, I didn't look Boss. at it like that. Hey. I yeah, okay, now I see now. Pass you the merch in Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. I Boss, I will take care of it. I okay. just need I you should to have give brought me a brave Boz, come on. How Boss. many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. <laughs> I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, boss. You won't regret this. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Nice. So, he took your word for it. I love when we actually have it for this. Also, Lon and Pashi, guys, thanks for the follows. Beetlejuice, I, boss. He took your he word for it. That meat had your you. word and he took it? Is that surprising? They're so impatient. It's called having a reputation. You should try getting one of your own. They're just words? They're just words? She doesn't mean Who it? Who the hell's Boz? Won't cause us any grief, I hope. Boz is a stand-up guy. Just Six respectful. Straight. You drive for gang goons. Is that not allowed? Street punks need things moved. I need money like anyone else. Fair enough. So, it's where to now? doesn't want to stay in. The Aldecaldo camp. The I avocado camp. The old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. All right. I'm actually loving that we're going to get to see one of the clans. Are they going to help us? Used to ride with the nomads you know, myself. Used to ride with nomads too. It's not going to win any favor really? with her. I never would have guessed. Yeah. Yep. Backer clan back in the day. Didn't work out between us, so I landed in Night City. Similar so origin story. In after all. Make her feel like we are a lot of common. Rogue said you're the cast out. Rogue Ooh. mentioned your friends. Said you guys stopped seeing eye to eye. Well, there since we Rogue said so, it must be true. It isn't? You mean to irritate me. Okay, then. Hang on. It was just a hiccup. They're still family. So it's complicated. You might say so. Oh, I wonder yes. what the corpo options are when you deal with other Nomads player. And Anon with five gifted subs to the channel and community. Thank you. Any chance they might help us Anon. in Rocky Ridge? That is the plan. She does audiobooks? Good, mm. let's roll. Get in. We're going shopping, but first, ma'am, just real quick. Let me, uh... Where is it? I think it's down below. Can I open this? Did you see that? There is, um... Uh, wait. Oh, it's right here. Here we go. Hmm. What do we have here? There we go. Odd graffiti strength. Here we go. Oh, look at the tattoos. Interesting. Strength. Strength is the card of resilience. It is associated with determination, bravery, and internal struggle. One must have dedication in order to overcome obstacles, and one reaches one's goal. And reaches one's goal. Strength is about physical prowess and spiritual fortitude. The power that must be unleashed to achieve the impossible. I love these tarot cards. Like the visuals on them, the art style is fantastic. What uh, audiobooks does she do? Oh, 
you could just explain the different... Oh, just explain the different financial statements to her? All right, fine. Get in. We're going shopping. Trivial with the gifted sub to Darrow. Wait, you've read them all. Wait, you were the one recommending them. Darrow, Andromeda? Andromeda, I guess. I always want to say Andromeda. Uh, trivial. It's amazing. I love it. Are you going to be there for the meeting? Where'd you get the ride? Straight out of some driveway in Rancho? Dang, she's driving like a prey mantis. Yes, exactly. Is that a problem? For me, no. Not at all. I mean, there's no accounting for taste. Screw you. Mmm. One chem dream. Keller, and welcome back in, I know. How far is the camp? Just past the city line. We'll jump on the nine and head east. No sun shining today, you know? You know how it is. How the hell did you land in this mess? I liked the color. The air freshener and boosters seat came extra. You know I oh, don't coffee. mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? She's a good driver. What about you? Why do you mm. need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. And I'm running out of time to get it. Hmm. She isn't crashing. So You're why didn't right. she tell me she knew about Nash? It's kind of pretty at Rogue, night. Do better not to worry what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand a bitch. But you have to deal with her in Night City, that's for sure. Also, Murmurs, have a good night. Thank you so much for hanging around. Wait, 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 Mr. Chill, what did you say? Can one of my mods pin that? Also, chicken waffles and king, guys. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Yeah, give. Screw Rogue. Rogue might just like pulling strings. You'll have to ask her about Nash. Hmm. Oh, that would be sick. Rogue like an actual one that you could buy. Laser pawns as she pleases. Did you just call me a pawn? But so am I. Got I got a good look at her. She rose to the top because she reads people. So what if she keeps things to herself? It's a skill in her profession. Mm -hmm. Well, I think she's a lying, manipulative bitch. <laughs> she put me together with that raffin. Did you know that? Nash? But seriously, didn't realize Nash was raffin? No. The sneak forgot to show me his shiv card. Don't you keep track of who's in the area? The wraiths, right? Until Bye, now, they mostly jumped corporate transporters day, down by Highway 64. I see you know things. I hope I see you tomorrow. No mad blood. Hmm. Rogue must have had her reasons. Must have had her reasons. I kind of you do trust say. Rogue. I know I shouldn't. Rogue won't open her mouth without weighing the for and against. What to spill and what to withhold. Hmm. Prime, thanks for the follow as well. Yes, a new camp. Her head is 50% hair. She's got so much hair, it's amazing. I love it, I'm jealous. Quite a quiet ride, you know? Aries, welcome back in. Trying to show off the noodle arms. <laughs> I know, I realized okay, we didn't do an arm. Uh, we'll gather my guys. We didn't even do an arm. Then Rocky Ridge. When I went to London this last time. Didn't even do a, oh. Huh. I love NC Thornton. Nice pants, middle seat in the middle. Wait a minute. Technical middle seat, however, awkward for whoever is that. Wait a minute. I guess you could squeeze somebody in between, but that poses. Okay. Well, would you look what the cat dragged in? Like she said, is to that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Fuck you too. And she brought a friend. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Hello. Uh, she can't function without me. Oh. Well, might not have needed a babysitter if you hadn't lost the merch in the car. Shut it, V. <laughs> Are you kidding? Sorry, that was a bad move. I shouldn't have made Did her look better. Did that beauty Thornton of yours finally bite it? <laughs> she rode it to death in old Night City. No, <gasps> it got clipped. Shit. Who dared? It doesn't matter. I'll get her back. That's why I'm here. Oh. We need your help. We're wasting time. Hit Let's him. be direct. Time's short. Come on. I know. No, I'm not trashing her. I'm not. Well, I love her. I love her. Over. I'll get them back, but I need your help. Come with me. We'll thrash them, the four of us. Bodes VA. You know, we would do anything for you, sister. But now? Oh, <gasps> hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight Doesn't and have the get same those traps, generators back but I still up don't after trust the him. batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? That's so many playthroughs, Scoop. Oh my goodness. We'll be fine without them. Oh, I, oh, I missed out. 
Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. I have a katana, I just don't use it. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Ooh. And am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But but Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. I guess Take it... whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Oh. Yeah. You're Thanks, right. Guys. Wait, Charles. I'll grab right, the gear. Right. Then be out of your head. Yes. I don't know why I always think of him as Bode now. I always forget. Yeah. Looks like you're stuck with me. I can hear it probably mm -hmm. more than this. I feel like I can never really you hear it when we're doing. I don't know. Maybe a little. Yes. Mm. Jadev, hi. Katalo. No, I don't think he's red in FF. I don't think he's red in FF. This is cool. Hi, Octane. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Pan Am. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Hey, Wolf and Sekiro. Shoot and ride. Have you brought someone new? Does Saul know? Not oh. your concern, friend. Let alone coming back to our old clan, but also bringing an outsider in. She's gonna be in trouble. I'm also gonna hack into all your stuff. Messages. Charles from Red Dead? Wait, have you ever played Red Dead, Big Mar? Will you help me with this? Quag, thanks for the follow, by the way. Yes, ma'am, hold on. Lame joke. Hey, how about this one? What do you call a Mexican or a soccer boss? A saburrito. Saburrito? 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 Alert, you've been attacked. Naturally. This is between Scorch and... Oh. Or I'm gonna tell Netwatch to cut off your net access. Now our burrito sounds really good. Oh no. I'm just hungry. A thousand beats a second. We need to take that for later. What's inside? I, a few odds and ends. You've that got be to. Useful. Light, take have it. a good one. Thanks for hanging right. around. And Kiwi. Everything. Let's go. All right, Saul is. We're just going to walk out without. No, out not Taco Bell. With Saul? Will you come back? Not Taco Bell. Not Slytherin. Follow New Vegas is amazing. It is beautiful. Yes. Light, have a great one. Thank you for hanging around. Panam, you'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. Oh, she's so sad. Provoked penguin. Hi. I wanted to loop more as well, but it's okay. We'll come back. Howdy, howdy, Andrea. So, hello. I'm off. Yeah, yeah. Go on. Go already. Drop. Call this. us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it that in the means trunk. we'll definitely see him more, though. Well, I guess he's probably done a, a whole slew of voices. Place and sad. And his chat does dad jokes, okay? <laughs> yes, they do. None better than Spazzy and Raj. Dynamic they duo. Go. Hop in. Albert, think, and also Uncle, guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. All right, it's becoming daylight, and I still think she's so beautiful. Oh. You got a real problem with authority. Mitch and Scorpion seem fond of you. Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. Oh. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part I, of it anymore. I like Still being a passenger, you like but I want to watch her too. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Haven't been so lucky. I see. I mean, we lost Jackie, so I mean, realistically, I don't feel like we do. Also, you have a good night as well, and I hope I get to see you later this weekend. How much do you know about Rocky Ridge? So, Rocky Ridge. Empty, dusty hole in the middle of bumfuck nowhere, I heard. Natives either moved to Night City or just got the hell out. Then you know almost all there is to know. Meredith! The whole area was waiting on a new interstate extension. Are they setting that up for a full relationship? into the town. Didn't happen, of course. How many ghost towns you think are there? Hundreds? Countrywide? Thousands. Thousands. I drove down I 80 the other day. All you have to do is pull over after sundown. It's quiet then. And you hear it. What's that? Oh. The wind whistling through boarded up windows. Tumbleweeds scratching across dry, sandy tracks. That's how towns die. Not with a bang. 
but with whispers and whimpers. Hmm. Can you imagine if they extended this across the whole of the United States? Like, it was that massive to be able to explore? I mean, I know that'd be insane. I mean, just think about the sheer size of Texas. But you can make a lot of it desert, right? And you can make a lot of it deserted, like she said. Scorpion and Mitch, the veterans. Were those two in the army? Scorpion oh. and Mitch? Yeah. Panzer boys. They haven't become They're cyber on contract soldiers. during the last war. Panzer boys? Flew those huge transporters? Scorpion piloted. Mitch ran security. They both got some kick-ass combat implants and a stack of really fucked up nightmares. Yeah, there's uh, most of the cyber cycles we've run into so far have been ex uh, or veterans. Hmm, with the combat implants. Interesting. Having withdrawals because Pan Am hasn't run over a single pedestrian. I need to like <laughs> Big Mar, you should. I definitely recommend trying it out. Um, I can say for a fact that it, it was never something that I thought I was going to enjoy that much. But um, the story sold it for me. Yeah, the story has definitely sold it for me. Bethesda did that with Daggerfall, a whole lot of a map. I've never even heard of Daggerfall by Bethesda. Jig, hi, by the way. Okay. Oh, no! We have arrived. I almost got all the conversation. What do we do? Almost. We get ready to greet the Raffins. And we have little time for that. We'll need to improvise. Done. Just we should scout quick. first. Yeah, 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 yeah. Scout first, scout first. Tier 5 components. Don't mind if I do. Oh, my goodness. Hold on. We're gonna do this first. It's like 30 years old. <laughs> Blade, welcome back in. Let me do something real quick. Call Millie. Bubby. Baby? Jun, thanks for the follow. Oh, Millie. What are you getting yourself into? How does that even happen? How does that even happen? I'm also walking. I'll unload here in a second. Hold on. Yeah, imagine Last of Us, but you actually trek all the way across as them. I kept my car for five minutes. Why can you stay calm for once? All right, let... Ooh. We got a new sniper. So we have the grad, but we also got the Nikomata. Faster attack speed, reload speed, and effective range. I'm actually willing to try that out. Let's go ahead and store this bad boy because it is an iconic. Let's go into clothes and just store as much clothes as possible. Because I think you can store pretty much anything. And I'm happy with my outfit for now. Oh, wait, I need to get my basketball shorts. We'll change our outfit when we go back to our home. Oh, all right. Nope, oh, currently equipped. There we go, 131. And when did I pick up right? Yes, the knives. The knives, the knives. There'd be a loading screen when you get into the car. No. <laughs> Everywhere you go, there's a loading screen. Let's go into inventory and do this. That's a lot of melees all of a sudden. I do want to store this guy. Well, I, I only like it because it's red, so I guess I should just disassemble. Just disassemble. All the knives we can disassemble. I'm not really getting into knife throwing. I think I just might have disassembled yours truly's weapon. But it's okay. We'll we'll get another one. Let's see what this is. Nope, that's the electric baton. No, that's the beta. That is not the. It was a. Was it a? Was it alpha? Steel pipe kind of looks fun. Switches from sniper to another sniper instead of reloading during combat. <laughs> uh, yes, I did. No, I didn't meet Meredith in those shorts. I just sold the. No, I sold the shorts. I met Meredith in. Do not worry. I did not meet her in those shorts. How dare you? I know, I know, Nitz. I haven't been doing mods. This was, this was 100%. Yeah, I know. I do have them on my sniper. This was <sighs> what I did with uh, Witcher as well. I felt like I never modded them out. Handyman short scope. We did do that on the other one, didn't we? <laughs> Crit chance 12.5, 12.5. That's funny. Range weapon mod, 8% damage against... Gotcha, gotcha. Draw the weapon automatically, refills to ammo, 20%. Armor penetration, weapon mod, power, Swiss cheese. 
That actually might be nice for that. I might. Adam, I do actually. I do. I'm looking into it being possibly something that we can scratch the surface this year. If we were to do something like Baldur's Gate with its... Oh, this is the revolver, right? Right, right. If we were to do something or a little bit of it, I'd probably go through like one act and then play a couple short games, then come back and do a second act, etc. I know it's taking over everybody's lives and I do that. I've really never struggled with uh, like FOMO with any of them, but for some reason, I've just, no it's been a long time since I've heard something so like critically acclaimed. Good morning, Night City. All right, we need to look for, I know there's some components in there, so we need to get inside. Here we go. It's super long, but super fun. Yeah, exactly. Act one took 100 hours alone. So maybe that's what we do is we do like one act and then we take a break and then we come back and do another act. I don't know if you benefit. Oh no, it's quad racer. Ooh, anybody need a purple PC? I feel like it would be fine. Like you wouldn't, I mean, would there be a lot of like degradation if you let some time pass between them? Old plastic gas masks. Anything else in here? Road traces. We've got another later. Sorry, Jax, I'm out. Put those new fridges in under the bar, set up the kegs, taps are all flowing, head on the brosif, foaming up preem. Guess all you need is some freaking customers, then we can talk. But seriously, as a friend, just sell the damn place. Never gonna finish this town. They hazed you good with the low rate mortgage. I know it. Got a feel for those kind of things. Anyways, you need something to hit me on the horn? I'm going back to pour and brew in NC Bozy. AKA Bozy. Jeremy, welcome back in. You may forget a lot of the side stories and stuff. <gasps> mm. Oh, that sounds like so much fun. Yes, absolutely. No, no, no. We'll catch you next time. Jeremy, thank you for popping in and keeping us up to date. Act by act is perfect. Plus, when I say we'll do a couple short games, it's not like we're going to play another 100 hours between. We'll probably just play... There's a couple games that are about 20 hours that I want to complete with you guys. Masala Studios. Sayonara? Wait a second. Before we start, have you wondered how this book ended up in our hands? Where it came from and who delivered it? Of course you haven't. Nobody ever wonders about things like that. It's a shame, because the answer is quite interesting. I'd go as far as to say it's fascinating. Not so long ago, most shipments were made via sea on freighters. Cheap and quick and relatively safe. But during the Fourth Corporate War, some genius in Arasaka had an idea to release automated, self-replicating mines. Mines! Controlled by an AI in the ocean. What could possibly go wrong? A lot, it turns out. The AI had a single objective. Destroy enemy vessels. Simple, right? Nusa Militech ships would get blown out of the water, while the Arasaka Free State ships would sail by untouched. Except for the AI's ironclad logic, since there were a non-zero probability that a vessel waving a friendly flag might also have enemies on board. In the interest of optimization, it would also be sunk. Of course, when the leadheads back at Arasaka headquarters realized, dang, realized what they'd done, they'd rush to update the software only for the AI to reject it as a virus. And thus, because of a handful of individuals' complete lack of imagination and foresight, the history of maritime travel came to an end. So let's come back to the question at hand. How did you end up with this book? Unless you live in Chicago, where it was published, then surely not via the internet, since that was destroyed by Bartmus. Maybe it was shipped by plane, but air freight is incredibly expensive, most likely not. By car? We can't rule it out, but if I had to bet on it, I'd say it came to your city via train. This is fascinating, by the way. Fascinating. Chicago. Imagine that trains, that's right, the ones that go choo-choo, have survived into the present day. Just last year, 15,000 miles of new train tracks were put into use, including the underground tunnel connecting Tokyo with Shanghai. At top speed, with an armored train, can complete that distance between the two cities in under five hours. Now that's something I had to experience for myself. Two days later, I was in Tokyo, standing on a platform of Saranara Station. I haven't read something in a while, and I don't know what made me want to read that one, but he hooked me with the how did you get a hold of this book? 
What knack? What? Self-replicating machines make for the most scary stories. Millie's on her way. Small, small. Thank you so much for 14 months. Also, we got a stretch. A stretch. Andrew and Mags. I know. Small, thank you so much. Oh, man. I don't think I ever found that shard. Were you actually reading all the shards? Pathology of the Badlands. Did we read this one? I like whoever's writing these, but this one we might need to come back to. Also, Dai, thank you so much for continuing your gifted stuff from London as well. Welcome back. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Beans, I wish. I wish. Mm. An explosion. All right, we're not headed this way. Wait, did I get that one? We are going to start chipping through the shards that I've picked up so far, because the more that I read, the less I have to read later, because they do repeat them pretty often, it seems. Oh, let's go ahead and uh, sell some stuff. Yeah, let me go ahead and sell junk, too. Dun, 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 dun. Mm, sell all junk, confirm. It's actually quite a few eddies for all junk. I'll take it. I'll take it. We need to look into crafting, too, after this, by the way. And also, Cubs in, welcome in. We need a chrome. We need to read chrome and sex. We need to read all of the... Oh, gosh. All of the fan fictions. I don't think chrome and sex was a fan fiction, though. Uh, right. Scan the devices in the area. Oh. Build your future in Rocky Ridge. This is relevant to the plot. Rocky Ridge, a true paradise far from the city bustle. A new development just outside Night City. Rocky Ridge isn't just a place to call home without breaking the bank. First units already available for reservation. A prime location or easy commute thanks to the planned freeway extension. But it's also the first exciting breath of life into the area and the headly promise of new jobs. Don't build your house on sand. Build it on Rocky Ridge. There's so many of them. Yeah, you can even just feel the emptiness here. Yeah. More complicated things. Wait, I missed that. Hmm. You skimmed them, but I loved the flavor. Should see the... Wait, wait. You should see my literal library in Skyrim. You can actually build a library in Skyrim? Is this going to be what gets me to start doing it? Uh, scenario hit. Trains are easier to leverage more things like planes. Oh, uh, yeah, I could see them getting back up a ra like a train working in this kind of situation. Mm hmm. Can I feel the emptiness? Can I feel it, Mr. Krabs? I can, Mr. Furious. I think I can. All right, so we need to get the machines back up and running. Scan the devices in the area. I think we just really need to scan one more thing. Down Rocky Ridge could be any debtor. Everything's down. Nothing works here. <laughs> The fashion its what's going to rock today. <laughs> the fashion in-game. I'm rocking the... Uh, what are we doing? Oh, yeah. You already know. We're rocking that uh, roach. Roach racing. Elusive Einstein 27 and Lord, guys. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. But can I really? Another shard. The failure of the Villar mission. Ooh, back to square one which undermines the progress of the Lyceral 3.0 program and our understanding of the exoplanet group may be definitive proof that the current space race is hindering overall space exploration efforts rather than fueling them through noble competition. In 2060, Lagaretta predicted that the pace of technological development at the time would lead to the confirmation of the existence of white holes and the discovery of the theory of for quantum gravity within 15 years and a quantum moon, Alas, those 15 years have come and gone. Perhaps if the ESC and the SRC and the orbital air tried to cooperate and share information in the spirit of science for a change rather than torpedoing each other's research, the situation today might be very different. <sighs> ah, Project Hail Mary. I do not claim to be a visionary as Lagaretta La was, but I would bet that my last Euro dollar, the next major mission success, will launch from O'Neill 1. Not Earth. We did learn more about O'Neill 1 as well. We got a short wave transmitter. Mm. I know, I instantly was like... What? Outer Wilds? Can I hack into these? Come on. No. No. 
Bad news bears. Well, have you found anything? Uh, I mean, I looted the place. I feel like we could always loot more. You can always loot more. I guess we could farm for some points, you know, distract enemies. No, this will be fine. Things are looking pretty up. Yes, yeah. Count high, by the way. Nothing? You come up with anything? Everything's down No here. dice. Nothing's up. I'll cut off. Oh, well, we'll make it work. The like weapons will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check. We do need to test out this new sniper. Hold on before we do that. Mm. I thought I got rid of it for a second. The okay, substation. Okay. Okay. Possibly. Scan the transformer. We'll see. Who's taller, V or the sniper? If it were me, the sniper. But V? Probably V. Mm-hmm. Transformer, it's up here. Oh, driven. Uh, beautiful. I mean, beautiful chaos, but... Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them! Juice. Not to worry! Come I down! Am. I know how to I'm surprise the bastards. I might be overcompensating with the sniper. Maybe not with my vehicle, but maybe with the sniper. <laughs> you're right, you're right. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? Mm-hmm. I like it, but you tend to the power, I'll toy with the shiv. Fine idea. Let's get us some Ultimus, power. I'll look around for access points. Great. They're likely to show up in numbers. We can't know how many. We need to outfox them, then get to my car somehow. Relax. Got a few ideas. I'll try to play a little game with them at the intersection. Oh, it's so much more than that, Hell Big yes. Mar. You can Perfect. collect as soon so as they many see the lights. Things. They'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First, we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk I'm of a junk nomad. without it. Yeah. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That okay. should do the trick. Wait for I me by the I love her attitude. I'll bring the car around. Yes, it is history. I believe so. Yeah, we just switched to it. Yep, the Nikomata. Yeah, I mean, there's so many different things to it. Also, Chuckable. Thank you so much for the Prime sub. Wait, where did you come from? I really appreciate that. Thank you. And I hope you enjoy the sub and the emotes and the ad for reviewing and everything. It's not a bad car. All right, let me pop over here. Wait for her by the substation. We can do this. Jason, hi. Blade, hi. Shinobi experiment? Me just zooming around is like building up my Shinobi? It's gotta be something else. Ooh. No. In good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and run. Brute force in. Grab the jumper cables from the truck. We'll boost it from the car battery. Yes. <laughs> Who needs to brute force the door when you can just do that? I'm exploiting it. Oh man, the voice actress for V sounds like Violet. Sounds like Violet, hold on. Violet from The Walking Dead Telltale. Wait, final season, oh, Violet, like a uh, actress? I haven't seen the, I, I've done the Telltales, but I've never played the game. For Walking Dead. Alright, take the jumper cables. Always have a spare. And also loot everything else too. Red cable connected. Got Give it. Me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Alright, take the your time. Rattler. Yeah, Violet from the Telltale. In season one, right? In season one? Violet, oh my gosh, I have to think of... I, I need to see faces. I need to see faces. I can't go by names. Uh, season four? Violet? Wait, let me... I, this is gonna kill me. I need to see her picture. Because I know, I know. You know what I mean? I know... Violet from... Walking Dead. There we go. Let me see. Let me see. Oh! Really? Okay, I have to hear it again. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh yeah. The Walking Dead Telltale. I loved it. I just, that's my oldest. I think that was my first game that I kind of came back to when I restarted my YouTube channel. So it's like the furthest back in my memory. Also, I saw you on YouTube doing Spider-Man and I thought I'd jump into the stream when I could. Chuckable, thank you. So many people coming from YouTube today. 
um really always but thank you so much and i am gonna make it back to spider-man 2 i am i'm convinced that i'm going to this year uh did you get to see miles morales as well or have you already played spider-man 2 and thank you for the sub and supporting me on both sides I'm just saying, what build am I trying to go for? Hold on, let me connect negativity. Um, intelligence tech. There she goes. But thought the old jalopy served us well. Kind of less tech okay, than I've I got thought. voltage. Start the terminal inside, and once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. Yeah, I ended up going less. It's not I'll the same actress, the but the sounds are similar. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so. Understood? Yes, ma'am. These are Pan Am's. Reflex. <laughs> That's why they give you the ability to go through here. It's just in case you have to get into it. Yeah. I need to go back to a telltale. Oh, I do. Oh, I can't get through games fast enough. Load, welcome back in. Hello and thank you. And already with, mm, already with the gifted subject gears of War Five. Amazing. Switch gears got power. Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get Lovely. All right, let's test out this new sniper, y'all. Now we wait. Mm. Remember, as soon as we see them, you that give us power. Rain. Which way are they going to come Raffins from? Raffins will come from where? Any North idea? or south or what? Northeast, I wager. From the freeway that was never finished. Got okay. it. Okay. Cover me just in case. Of course. Ready with. Ready with the good of two jackass. <laughs> They're rolling in. I also just played Quarry and it was also really, mid. Really hard to miss. Let's sub mid for price. me. Sub mid for me, but I definitely quiet. get it. If anything happens, I'll start picking them off. Sound good? Sounds great. Oh, we're about to see if we like this weapon, that's for sure. If the bad guys showed up in Millie's car, I wouldn't be able to take them out. Who is that? You can't really be sneaky when your whole yeah. hair is glowy. Get good and ready. The show starts. Yeah, now. but she's the least in it, Reflex. Let there be light. Grab the car, The driver has I've been made. No idea. We have to pick all of them off now. Oh, okay. I was like, wait. Okay, so I don't think we had to do that, but then I don't like it as much. I don't, I don't. It's not as satisfying. Mm, 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 mm. -mm. I like my Milwaukee, I do. Oh, snap. All right, let's just throw some, just chuck them, chuck them. Cause some crazy stuff for me. <clears throat> nope, further down below. Far out. Stick your head back out, come on. Whoa. Oh, it's cause I'm crouched. Hold on. I'm not really good when I'm crouched like this. Heads up, reloading. Pan Am's probably a boss. Oh, Pan Am, move! Yep. Alright, one more down. I'm gonna flatline it on my area. Oh, she's got the crazy zoomies. Let me get her. Alright, one last, one last. She's got crazy zoomies. Bullets flying. Duck down for a second. This is not my best. Watch out! Grenade! I know, I'm gonna get to her car in a second, but we have to take them out first. She's got the zoomies! Did you say giving away the high ground? I did not need to do it like that. I don't know why. Let me reset that. I gave away my position. I was using a different sniper. It just wasn't good. Full shinobi. I know, it was a cheap crop shot too. Wasted HR. All right, let's try this this way. Look for the girl with the mohawk. Call me a bunch. Look for the girl with the mohawk? I think they all have a mohawk. Fuck. Covering you. Okay. Launch out that way. Not good. Let's go over here. I'm gonna go over by here. I'm gonna take out this person right there. Oh, I thought I killed her. Oh my gosh, they're shredding. I'm a reflex, I'm just happy to be able to catch stream. Is it the weekday? The weekday streams are at like such odd times. I think this is because they're genuinely sending the most amount of stuff I've ever seen. I've never seen this many. It's 
because there's so many of them and they're just launching explosives. Look at all these explosives! What the heck? Pop your head back up. You know what? This is like a full grenade run. There we go. Another one bites the dust. Rotate, rotate. Another one. Royal Spoon, thank you for 17 months. I think he killed himself. No, no, no. He's still alive. Still alive. Still alive. All right. Go. Did he say how do you like the apples? Please tell me. Uh, this is very hard. Yeah. Uh, intelligence tech build, but I've kind of been rotating a little bit. It's not quite... Let's pack it in. It's not quite that clean because I'm not really doing, uh, let's see. The one that I'm not really going into is... So tech, I am. I'm going, like, chrome maxed out, but intelligence I just haven't been using as much as I thought I was going to. Veal, by the way, welcome back in. Uh, I wish she had turned the lights on. Or she did. She turned the power back on. What's she gonna do? He did. How do you like them apples when he launched it? Oh, get off. Tier two components. What's happening in here? Rotary is back online? All right, we just have a green component over here. I'm gonna get in the car. Let me see if there's anything that popped out of here that we hadn't looked in. Yeah, I don't think so. Um, I think I already reset. No, no, I didn't, no, I didn't. Wait, did I? No, 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 I didn't, I didn't. They honestly were carrying garbage. I don't know what I expected from them, but I guess I thought there was gonna be a little bit more. A little underwhelmed with that. It was underwhelming, probably because I don't have any, I don't have any I'll mods on it. And I also just feel like that wasn't, oh. Leave the driving to the pros. Couldn't wait. What are you waiting for? Uh, leave the driving. Sure, sure. Leave the driving to the Monocle, pros. Monocle, thank you. <laughs> Hello. Thank you for four months. Yeah. Fine. At last. Is this her baby? Okay, it's not bad. She already knows. All right, my driving's not that bad, guys. Come on. Eh? She's prime wheels, isn't she? Like a dream. Dreamy indeed. No surprise you wanted her back. She completes me. Just because you run people See, over doesn't mean your driving's bad. Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. Now I help not me. get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show do you think he knew it was set up? No. He wouldn't have known. A7 temporary, guys. Thanks for the follows. There's no way. The hundreds of civilians would disagree. Your revengeful kick. I see where this is going. Listen, I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got them. Yeah. Sixth Street Just awaits word and I... me, for fuck's sake. I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. Okay. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. Yeah, Zuku, thank you and welcome in. Yeah, it's incredible so far. Much to What's my surprise. In you want to raid the Raffin base? Are you out of your mind? Let's do Sixth Street deal first. Nash Hunt wasn't part of the deal, but I'm always down for a good headshot. Want to just show up at the Raffin hideout? Mm -hmm. Are you out of your mind? Do you have a better idea? Let me hear it. Matter of fact, I do. We take this stuff to 6th Street, then go after Hellman like we planned. I gave you my word, didn't I? Please stop writing my ass about Hellman. And do not start acting high and mighty. Like you won't lift a finger if it's not in the contract. Just, not true. Just help me get Nash. Not entirely true. Know what we agreed on? Uh, there is XP on the table on those bad boy. Hold on. Where are we looking at? I want to get to 60 headhunters so fast. Engineers 25. Um, I feel like a lot of people like Judy. That was the other one that a lot of people talked about. Fine. Uh, all right. 
So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Not that I have the time for this, but I can't say no to that face. I, she's me. just, she's what so nasty. genuine and sweet and I don't have a lot of friends in this city, guys. I placed my trust in him. I know my net he running skills are so He was the first person so I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. Who is she in Life is and Strange? I granted him my trust. It's the freckles. Sucker for him. Vengeance is rarely worth the risk. Know how you I feel. I get it. Know how you feel. No friends, only choose. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. But if they had it, would you have done it? Maggie, cat, yeah, cast wanting friends in real life and cyberpunk. Without a doubt, still not worth it. There's one thing I've learned in Night City. It's that sometimes revenge is not sweet. But everybody's Always doing it, so... stand to lose more than you might gain. I don't think I'll ever play by Night City rules. Chloe. Yes, it sounds like her. Yep, Are done. you ready? Oh my, look at that. That's the face of revenge. Let's run Let's him Let's get him. Mohammed and Versailles, hey guys, thanks for the follows. Welcome in. Okay. You do it. No Pan Am's VA is Emily Wu Zeller, not Ashley Birch. She almost sounds like Chloe. She sounds very similar. Mm. Oh, snap. All right, time to go. Could have had me fooled. All right, let's see how she does. I'm on fire. Not ideal. I'm hitting over a thousand now consistently on the headshots. Nice work. Cars inbound. Let's go. Oh yeah. Oh, there's somebody with a sniping capability. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna flatline. I'm gonna flatline. Stay down. I always just keep getting ahead of myself because we've only recently switched to going on very hard. Sniper on the loose. Yeah, the sniper. It's the sniper's up above. I know. I was thinking Naden coming too, Wima. I was. Don't jinx it. Don't you dare jinx it. There we go. Pop your head up. Pop your head up. Come on. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Another sniper over there. I, well, I'm really trying to max out the headshot counter. Nope. 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 Getting cyber remote function. Hold on. I don't actually see it. He's down. His head's not there. All right. Throw some of these out. I see a sniper, right? Oh, he's still alive. He's still alive. One more shot and he's done. He's down. He's mustard. Oh, pull. This guy. It's gonna be the bane of my existence. Just gonna. Uh... I'm about to have an imminent oh, system yeah. collapse. Hold on. Wait, what? <laughs> Take her out, Sergeant Fails. <laughs> I'm not about to have a. No, 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 no. Try not to get hurt. Someone take their position. I forgot that I have other weapons besides my sniper. Anybody else? Nice. I've never, I don't know, I didn't know what was gonna happen if the collapse hit, but I didn't wanna see. I just figured I was gonna die. I just, I thought I was gonna die, so I just went for it. Body identified, enemies have been alerted. Oh. I love the combat music. I thought it was gonna instantly kill me if I allowed it to hit. As soon as it said system shutdown, which is broken and we need to get that for ourselves. Yes. <laughs> what would you take with me? A sniper? I'm not good at a lot of things, but put a sniper in my hands and I'll pop some heads for you. Uh, 
We should start disassembling some of these as well. Oh. What? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Sir, you did not, this, this is, oh my goodness. You did not get the memo. Uh, uh, he did not get the memo. Oh, that's Nash. That's Nash. Okay. Well, that sucks. That sucks. It did the music as if we were safe. Is that supposed to happen? Here we go again. I got bossed. I was shopping. <laughs> I got distracted. Window shopping, you know. Here we go again. Mama, just how much I missed you. Come on, Pete. Okay. Let's do it again. Just time for more headshots. Third out, flatlined. And Pan Am's gonna get him. Nope. Oh, Pan Am saying I'm impressive. Love to see it. Shut your fucking mouth! Alright, two cars coming in. Need to watch out for those snipers. Sniper up top. Critical headshot. Sniper across the way. Let's get him. Oh, need to take a breather for a second. Is he still in there? I don't think so. Eat lead, stay dead. Eat lead, stay dead. Weapons glitch is fine. I don't care about that. Does it get blocked out by like rocks or anything? Hmm. That guy. Oh, yeah, no, the weapons glitch actually kind of sucks. Oh! But we still got it. Oh, yeah. I am shocked by that. They're on their last legs! Ugh. He's healing, he's healing. Your phone's glitching. That's in. It's really hard to see their heads in this cave. Throw some grenades. Throw some grenades. Heal up a little bit. One more person. I love her BM. So sassy. Alright, there's one more in there. There's definitely one in there. I saw. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I think that's who killed us, right? Yeah, because my sniper is not hitting him. I'm getting wrecked by this mission. Oh, I shouldn't have moved up that fast. Scooby boy, thank you for seven months. Seems like only yesterday I found you crazy bunch. Seven months, especially too. What were we playing? Oh, what was it? I almost said Elden Ring. I almost forget about uh, Mass Effect. No, no. I have an outer wild feeling somehow. Did he get me in the headshot? I couldn't hit him with my sniper though. Mass Effect. Mm, seven on, months ago, it wasn't Mass Effect. It was really Survivor. No. Oh, yeah. Let me start by healing. Star Wars, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think it was Star Wars. Can I please get, like, beyond this? I hate Hell that I'm... Yeah. Whaler. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting I'm on very hard, so I just am going in, running in with my, like, my gun in my hand, you know? Whaler with five gifted subs to the channel and community as well. Whaler, thank you so much. Guys, if you just got a gifted sub from Whaler, I hope you give him a big thank you. I like the gunfights though. I'm happy to keep doing them, to be honest. Leroy Jenkins. Oh, come on, the car. Oh, yeah. Woo! Monocle. Monocle, it's your first time in here. And you just gifted a sub as well. Five subs. Monocle, thank you so much. Whaler, Monocle, guys. Work, trying to get these headshots off and y'all are distracting me. Thank you. You're mine now. Uh, truly. Where did you come from, Monocle? I'm on him. Come on, Pete. I need to start using quick hacks. That's the biggest problem of it all, is I'm not even I'm not even using my quick hacks. 
Okay, I can finally hit him though. This is how we ride. This is how we do. I need to be careful that he doesn't sign me back though, because he will instant shot us, I think. It's just uh Woo! Hold on. Let's do a cyber malfunction and then follow up with a sniper shot. I think I'm able to hit him when he has a malfunction. Otherwise, I can't. Yes, 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 yes. Where is the monocle one? Yeah, see, look, it almost misses him, but if I hit him with a... Oh, I can't. I don't have any more pin. Coffee, thanks for the follow as well. Guys, I hope y'all enjoyed the sub and the emotes and the channel. I feel like he's going to be able to hit me from here. I see a sniper. Careful. Get around the bitch. Yeah, All right, I got him. I got him. Let me reload. This is how we do it. Gosh. I love headshots so much. Let him hang out. Two more. Also the main guy. The main guy. I can't get too comfy. I think he's actually... Yeah, he's right there. All right, come back up. All right, Bandit. Thanks for the follow as well. Oh, oh, there he is. There he is. Okay, let's do this thing. Let's go. Cyber remote function. There we go. There we go. You can tell I played COD. No, me? Never. Phantom. Phantom, thank you for two months and welcome back in. Oh, I want to get him with a jump shot. Is the guy upstairs there? Okay, don't let our defenses down because the other guy might still be around. Nash, right? Nash is still crawling around somewhere. I don't trust it. I can't go shopping again like last time. F1, F5, F5. Need to remember to save more. The Widowmaker tactics. <laughs> oh yeah, with sub, wait, with the cyberpunk sub genre. So the game felt like a damn assignment? No. I really haven't had a lot of exposure to this kind of subgenre. I was just talking about how I watched Blade Runner for the first time. Yeah, I did save it. I did. Thank you. Uh, also, Fej, thank you for the follow. And I think I missed a couple follows before when I was getting... Re oh. When I was getting reset. <laughs> but welcome in, guys, if y'all are new here. Oh, man. Also, don't judge me. Hello as well. Uh, uh, mm, mm, mm. I've yet to play the game because of that. I can see it kind of being a C, C, C. I can see that by, uh, yeah. I could see not wanting to do that because of that. I think having pretty much zero exposure to this genre makes you enjoy it that much more. Calling it a subgenre is disrespectful. I only said what they said. Don't come at me. Hello, Rogue. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Yes, I, I have. Did. Oh, yes, One I have, Pavetto. Happy? And this I'll have you know, I know there's a main mission happening, but uh, I got this outfit from number one on Road Race, okay? Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut. I was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about this when you were up chasing down a vendetta. Oh. Fuck. Oh. Feel better now? So, feel any better? I'm gonna be a little saucy, dude. Maybe a little. Let's get out of here. Wait. I'm hacking into this upstairs first. I, you're right, I have to get my net runner up. There we go. All right, jack in. Let's try this. Let's see this happens. Legit smack dog. <laughs> Reflex. <laughs> like, don't come at me. I'm sorry. Hands up. British. Wait, no, brightish. Brightish. Thanks for the follow. Welcome in. No. Uh, 7A. We need a 7A to an IC. To an IC to a BD. And that means we need to take it to a. 7A. Okay, I'm gonna try this, but I, well, let's go 55. I'm going 55. I've messed up. I've messed up. I've messed up. 
0.7a yeah i knew i was gonna fail one i just knew it Ugh. jason <laughs> where's jason let's try this real quick choco thanks for the stretch as well mm. hypocrites poncho to groovy didn't finish yesterday, so I'm writing here. Sure, you'll read it once you take care of those farms out in the Selenas. Good luck, by the way. Anyways, never heard of anyone taking anyone back once they're raffin. But sure, maybe we should be the first. They're all hypocrites anyway. I mean, your whole life, they feed you this non-stop scop shit about family first and clan unity. And then as soon as you hit a rough patch, they turn you into a pariah. Uh, we didn't hit a rough patch. We wiped our, the two. Oh, we wiped two of our own. So, I mean, they kind of had a point. If I were you, I wouldn't burn any more brain cells over this. They've done it, nailed it, coming back with full load. Fine, maybe they have a point, but whatever happened... Wait, wait, whatever happened to forgiveness? Second chances. I'm telling you, they want the Raffins to exist. It's like we're their negative image. They warped mirror they... Wait, wait. That warped mirror they like to stare to feel superior to. That warped mirror they like to freaking stare at? Oh, I got you. But what they don't get is Night City sees no difference. They think we're all the same. To them, we're all just one big gang of home-on-the-range weirdos living outside the system. It's effed up anyway, and that's a fact. Ponchi, is Skylar mad at you again? You're not getting laid, right? Because you always get all lyrical and shit when you hit a dry spell. More, ah, uh, more screwing and less philosophizing. Is there a correlation there? <laughs> See, somebody's still here. She's running away like we're out of this. There is somebody firing at me. Ma'am? Ma'am? I know. I'm trying really hard to keep, keep a wholesome here. Get high at home with the homie these days when the police have so much to worry about. <laughs> they have so much to worry about, whether than that our kids smoking special cigarettes, when designer drugs can be bought on a corner. We say back to the basics. Why line producers and dealers pockets when you can make your own concoctions in the comfort of your own garage garage. And the following chapters will give you quick and easy follow steps for your favorite boosters. Making it at home. There is another person here. Panem knows me. Don't kill everyone. Tier one items. I am starting to see things. No, somebody is firing at us. I'm gonna... I'm saving. Something was shooting at us. I'm not imagining this. Don't... All right, maybe I am. Ooh. That was a, uh, that was a, wait, hold on, look at that. It was in the car on fire. The Drano concoct, wait, wait, concoction. We just got a precision rifle. The Widowmaker. You guys weren't kidding. All right, let's test it out. We'll see it, it's not in lieu of the sniper, I think we could do the precision. Oh. No, 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 no. That's why he was always zeroing you. This with the, yep, 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 yep. This is Nash's gun. Here we go. Girl is an avocado, could be a problem. Pitch camp nearby, job goes south, risk of retaliation, but screw it. Pan Am Palmer, new in town. Uh, avocado's either starting biz in Night City or something else is up. Girl asked around for a job at the afterlife. They're doing recon. Or Palmer's on her own. Okay, job in the bag. Palmer doesn't suspect a thing. Unsure about Fixer. But if she's like the rest, couldn't give a flying frick of so long as the merch gets moved and the Eddies find their way home. Wheels look worth at least as much as we can owe the Hungarian. Toss in a few extra packs and done. Oh, there it is. So I was doing the right thing to kill him too, by uh, kind of jamming him and then hitting him with a sniper. Is it the car on fire that's making the noise? You hear that, right? 
I keep hearing all the- It must just be glitched out for something. It's- it's like a ricochet. It's the sound of a ricochet. Oh, I'm on fire. And that's the smell of burning flesh. bitch that broke? Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? Uh, oh. Never that. It wasn't me stepping no on it. To the other end of I the tried stick. doing it again. Think she might need a nice strong shock. Right, right, right. Get in, we're going shopping. Choco, have a good night, and I hope I see you tomorrow. We're gonna hey, do boss. an early morning stream go tomorrow, so we're probably not gonna stay on too, too late tonight. Also, no, no Doug, hi. Come on, let's meet. Sunset what was Motel. The series of events to me holding up a Buster Sword with Matt Mercer. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Hold on, Mike. Hold on. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Okay, she's talking. Let's on. do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Six Street, want to try? Sunset Motel. Sunset Motel? What's that? A safe spot. It's not far from here. All right. Sixth Street not likely to pull anything? I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Okay, that's Should roll. be fun. Just driving through the walls. And you guys said she was the better driver. And you guys said. I didn't realize this was gonna be the whole stream mission. But I guess this is why you guys say there's not too, too many main missions to begin with. I wish it was the Notel Motel. It says a lot about my driving. <laughs> I'd love to ask about her ink. I, but I don't even see ink on her, actually. They're here. Um, so Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? About the... No. About At your carabiners. So. What? Oh gosh, look at that hat. Flashbacks, look at that. Cover Pan Am. <laughs> wow. Hey, boss. Pan Am! How's Sixth Nash? Street. Didn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't well. call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got <laughs> balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? He's just here to keep you in line. Ooh, got a little more sass than Nash, do you? Look at the guy see. to the right, just <laughs> staring like straight into my one. soul. Spike. There, first class merch. Mm hmm. Spike, thank you. What's in there? God's so, Everything's in order? Check your account. Flying Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Mm. Let's roll. All right. That one. Uh, I don't think we should put it away yet. Come on, let's get a drink. I can get behind that. Spike, thank you so much for 18 months. Jedi on Sith crime. <laughs> Ginger cats. Oh, Ginger Raffin's hasn't popped wiped. in here today. Six streets pleased. This is Pretty good day for. Pim Hold on. Hope our little hothead gets the job done. Good luck. Nash is dead. Congrats. Because I don't think it was just a matter of wounded egos. Even wounded egos wouldn't do something that gonk. Hmm. Rogue. Okay, Man let me call her. Let me try calling her. not over yet. You still have a She's not going to answer. Off. She's mad at me. Robbie, thanks for the follow. Spike, thank you so much. I should have accidentally done a grenade. I mean accident. Oh, my am is cheeked up on a Friday? On a Friday. Yes, triple fisted. We did. Oh, I keep trying to put this thing away. <gasps> my favorite lamp. Hello, Noah. Let's see what's going on hey. here. Hold on. Oh, nice one. Back there. Here we go. This is the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune means that change is coming. One's destiny could turn out for the better or the worse, yet it also bears the promise of new possibilities. The wheel reminds us that nobody remains at the top forever, but also that is not a, every situation. Oh, and also that not every situation is hopeless. Airstrike and coming on them, Raffles? no. Nah, it's been quiet. They'll be back sure enough. This We've place seen this seen worse. What can I get you? Burritos. Feel alive in the oh, you want to grab a drink? 
Zon? I hate this commercial. It's so weird. It gives me don't hug me, I'm scared vibes. You can talk to him. Spike. I know. Spike. Thank you for five gifted subs as well. So many gifted subs today, guys. The burritos are so accessible in the future. Oh, so yeah. That package for street. What was it? You didn't peek? Valoperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos uh, in our midst. They trade in them? Thank you. Yes. They have deals with black clinics, rippers. Hmm. To what's ahead? To your ride. Well, here's to that thorn of yours. Thanks for everything, partner. She called us partner. That's one step closer. That's one step closer. Never fade away. Oh, oh man. Over here. That's my kind of gal. My goodness. Pan Am is the go. <laughs> she just put that down. Thanks, Noah. Jeez. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. I see. Plan leader Saul, what's his story? Listen, you and Saul. Mo, thanks for Who that. Who is he? Won't be putting it Your down leader like that. Or chieftain? Their leader. We're pretty keen to delta the hell out of there before he got back. Well, let's just say Saul wouldn't have been happy to see Such me. Such a weird what beer happened? bottle. <sighs> the reason we came to California was because he promised to change for the Alda Caldos. He claimed we would turn over a new leaf. But you saw it yourself. We got a handful of tents on a heap of sand. Mm. A hell of a promised land. Expected more. Fair enough. It's a thick bottle. I wanted something different. Better. But Saul's a damned coward. I think Jawa's He'll be the end of the clan, I'm certain. Think you might ever go back? The Alta Caldos. Think you'll ever go back? I mean, not right now, but someday. I don't rightly know. Her voice is amazing. On the one hand, I don't have anyone outside the clan. Shit, I don't really know any other life. But on the other? Without my clan, who am I? What would I become if I stayed in Night City? Hmm. Oh, sh Friends are hard to come by in Night City. I want to answer that, but I also, like, I love doing... Sorry. Had to leave my clan, too. Oh, yeah, I remember. From Nomad Back to Nomad, family, you know. Right? Mm-hmm. Then I came to Night City. Saw my chance. Down the Took it. And? And I lost almost everything. Shit. That's comforting. I actually like B's voice a little bit more, though. I think there's so much. I mean, there's well, motioning. Let's talk about something else. But V has such range Anything in else. her voice. I'm done with Raffin for good. The Raffins. We done with them? Oh, no. The shiver cockroaches. Top. <laughs> One's never rid of them. But it should be quiet for a time. Although she's giving Milwaukee. Only to gather yeah, their Milwaukee wits jacket. And dust themselves off. Let's talk about Anders. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I when? need to sleep on it. Work I was it okay. Then we can talk about the details. I feel like that's bull and you don't know what you're I doing think yet. best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Mm, yeah. I feel like that's just buying her time. <laughs> Maybe What's gotten into you? This choice is difficult. JV and also Sai, guys, thanks for the followers. I, mm, I'm gonna get rejected. I also feel like I'm the? so. I feel like I should just drink. Maybe only one room? Mm-hmm. Noah has two twin beds in every room. We'll save some money. Not exactly what I meant. Separate beds, got it. Look at that smug smirk of hers. Oh my goodness, look at that smirk. What's gotten into you? Not quite what I had in mind. I know. Just glad to have met you, so I thought... Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm glad we met too. She's like, next that time. That was a damn tough day. But still, we pulled through. And we'll do it again tomorrow. I like to hear that. I know her facial are expressions right? are insane. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. 
No one will need a room. Twin beds. Just for tonight. It's okay. At least we put it out there. I'll go catch a few. Put ones. it out there. And that doesn't mean no. I need to drink one after that though. I know, I know. I'm standing. You literally destroyed her feelings, but she's going strong. She's just, uh, she's playing the long game. Jeez. What was that? Sparkling? Mine. <clears throat> My decanter now. Oh, we can't play this one. Oh, I'm just kidding. Not friend zone just timed out. Where's room 18? Room 18? Anybody? Oh, she's passed out. That's so weird. Why is she passed out on one side of the bed? It's a twin bed. She's like curled over to one side on a twin bed. Is there even enough? If they're twins, is there enough room to... I guess maybe not. It's the beads. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. We've seen cyberware uses and their effects. Ooh. Medical gauze. And not you. Oh. Uh, oh. Oh, what? What? Why are there double? Ugh. Why are there double clear? Why? I'm. I'm disgusted by this shower placement. When? When have you ever seen a double curtain rod? Like a double curtains for a shower? I've never seen that even in the fancy of uh, what? I knew it. I knew. <laughs> I just it's French doors the French obviously if you have like a glass yeah I've seen French door glass showers but French door clear why do you even have oh my gosh the tub is also just not it I haven't but it's in the future oh, okay Scalter, thanks for the follow I also love how even in the future though we're still keeping with the colors of the hot and cold Howdy, partner. And all the just copious amounts of medicine that's just lying out, and then all the creatine everywhere. It's very Dexter. Jonin, or, uh, is it Joanne? Joan? Sebastian. Welcome in. French door curtain showers? Who the? F oh, that's not. That was me. I was about to. Oh, I can't even pull my weapon out here. Do you get a choice? Do you get a, do you get a choice? Good night. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Yeah, we didn't even pull the curtains. I guess there's no curtains, but I'm gonna try this in my bathroom now. Oh, I kind of want to try it now. And you know, but maybe that's the thing is maybe we should have this as a thing. I might do it in my guest bathroom. Just not clear. Meet me at Sunset Motel Garage. I'll be waiting. Ma'am? How did you just text me? You're oh my god! Oh my gosh! Where did she come from? Where? Also, I need to send this one out. I forgot about that. Oops. Just slept past it. Forgot about that one. Whoa. Yeah, I forgot about the text to it. Yeah. Freaky. Lightning breaks. Okay, this is uh, before we get to the uh, room 18, am I right? Cyber psycho sighting and phantom of. Oh, job complete. Right, right, right. What's going on? What the fuck? Okay. She bolted. Ma'am is a runner, is a track star. All right, so that's where we're supposed to go and meet her at midnight. However, what time is it? I feel like this next. I feel like this is going to start the whole next main mission, right? <gasps> Oh no, look at all the and are more mm, okay. I think I already asked this question, but the NCPDs that are on the map are already here, right? Like there's they're not going to spawn more, correct? I killed a capture of the ratio on cyber psychos. Actually, um they're not bad. This is all of them, right? This is main campaign. L, this is my first playthrough, so we're just main campaigning it. Okay, hold on, hold on. Who can say? Who can say? 
Our cyber psycho ratio is actually pretty good right now. Also, Freyden, thank you for eight months and welcome back in. Thank you. We do have a gig out here. Nope, nope, just hands. Lightning breaks. Me pan him at midnight. Y'all? Are those representing mines? Are those mines? Did they call it a mine? A mine? I think that's the trash area. Isn't that just the trash area? Don't actually answer that. Yeah, floppy pickle. No, not floppy pickle. All right, we're gonna clear some NCs real quick just to kind of get some items. The vast majority, but sometimes. It's the map freckles. Yeah. <laughs> Millie, baby, where are you at? I thought she was gonna hit me. To be honest, this time I really thought she was gonna hit me. Yeah. Oh, snap. Okay, let's head this way. We're gonna take out some of these. Actually, I wanna go take out some cyber cycles. I'm feeling cyber cycles. Uh, we'll come back and do NC PDs at the start of tomorrow. But I wanna do some cyber psychos. Yeah. Sir Psycho Sexy. Uh, cyber psycho psychos. Uh, also, we need to go to the 6th Street. Yes. I'm trying to do a couple cyber psychos every single stream, just like maybe doing one job, one gig. Every stream, if we just do. Whoa. No, 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 no. We don't need to randomly kill. No, we don't have a My My emote. I should do an animated My My emote somehow. I don't know how we do it, but a cheese grater on wheels. Woo! Rancho Coronado. We should find. I need the. I need to get some new clothes, y'all. I think it's this way. Yes, take the exit. I'm getting dark urges. Whoa. Here we go. Fast and furious. Whoa. Oh, oh my. Oh my. Oh. Okay, I'm 100% playing with fire now. I did it, I did. There's like, she's so sensitive, guys. <laughs> Millie, please. Am I on a, yeah. Why am I always on history? Wait. Yeah, stay on history. Millie tapping into her prime Godzilla. Oh, here we go. Whee! Sorry. Okay, we're fine. The dash cam rails on TikTok? No, I don't have TikTok. What are these? I don't know why I'm so drawn to the sidewalk. I don't know. I need to leave it alone. <gasps> Wait, is that a... Wait a minute. Watch out. These are fast vans. All right, he's gonna have to slow down because of the rules of the road, which don't apply to us. Oh. Units in the area. Criminal activity confirmed in Santo Domingo. That's that's probably I fair. That's confirmed criminal yeah, activity in that's, Santo Domingo. <laughs> that's fair. 521 reporting. Sorry, dispatch. Had to take a leak. I'm on route. Whoa now. Okay. That's gonna hurt tomorrow. <laughs> you have like 50 <laughs> plus hours of NCPD encounters, maybe more, without taking into account driving. <gasps> Relic malfunction. What? Really? Cause um Oh, I haven't looked at them yet. It'll buff out. Yeah. Let's get this. Zuku, yeah, I was just talking about that. I think possibly this year we'll do like act one or something. All right, Sir Cybo 16. He's sleeping the internal sleep. Oh, snap. I didn't, well, they're not looking for me anymore. I can tell you that much. These minivans sketching me out. Yeah, we're gonna test out the Widowmaker. We'll test it out. I think they actually freak out if you have a weapon on hand. Oh. Wait, I didn't get a message from- Oh my, that's not normal. That's not normal. Ma'am? 
gonna save real quick because I feel like wait what? I don't think that's the cyber psycho we're looking for. That might be it. Oh my. Regina is not messaging me right now. Revolver this. Holy snappily, okay. I'm thinking I can just kind of stay up here and then not deal with him. It's the music for me. Gosh, he, he, yeah, I have to wait for the right moment. What do you mean I'm cheesing it? You guys are doing it different ways, that's on y'all. I'm just using my surroundings. Get her for his head. Come here. Oh! We need to wait for more grenades to pop in. He has a shield too. I think we've seen unmanned versions of this, right? I don't know how many manned versions we've seen. Garfunk, thanks for the hundred bits. Fair point on who's cheesing who. No kidding. Garfunk, thank you for 200 more bits as well. And <laughs> Skytook, thank you for the follow. It is still gonna take a while just because of damage. I might do this. Might go for his head. Yeah, oh, that's not gonna take. Oh my gosh. Oh, disgusting. Did you see how much damage that took? This, yeah, why would I change to any other sniper? He's down. I think he might be eternally down, but... Search area to collect information as well. Yeah, I, well, I mean, don't GG. I was up on the roof like Santa, but... Got the job done. All right, we need to explore the area. We can disassemble all of these. This sniper is disgusting. Oh yeah, it doesn't look good. Here we go. Let's find out what happened. I gotta say that Mary of yours sure has a head on her shoulders. She got you here last time, or at the last possible moment, unlike me with Jesse. Your body is rejecting the implants, and no wonder. It's not ready for them. They're military grade. You can't use them without proper training. Jeez, they're not for civilian use at all. I can give you a script for painkillers, but don't forget, the pain in your is your body's way of warning you. If you ignore it and keep using that chrome, you could cause permanent damage to your spine. Edron, you might be able to take that off the exoskeleton by now, but if you break your spine, you'll never move on your own again. Oh, Mac, thanks for the follow as well. Just visiting Jesus, Giacomo. <laughs> Just having a good old nap time. I, I feel like I keep accidentally killing them. I really do. Not meaning to. I didn't do it. I didn't do it. There. Oh. Well, hold on. Killed a lot of people. Probably even the doctor who was just trying to help. See what his email said. Hmm. Now I want mac and cheese. Quit your crying. This is Tom to Chase. All right. So Chase was the guy that we just took down. Tom. Let me be plain. You've been in this biz long enough to know it's a rough way to make a living. This job should toughen you up, but instead you keep coming to me looking for a shoulder to sob on. Now most companies just swap out their workers when they're tired, but not me. Here I try to show you some compassion. I even rounded up some gear for all, for all of you at a decent price. And what do I get in return? Ungrateful lunks like you just think about yourselves, your comfort, company be damned. But it's thanks to me that you got decent implants and a low rate loan to cover them. So he, did he know that this was going to cause this? So you didn't have to waste your time going from bank to bank, filling out forms you can't even read. But I 
But do I get so much as a thank you? Never. You know, if it weren't for Mary and Charlie, I would have kicked you out on your ass a long time ago. So try thinking about them for once and get back to work instead of crying to me. This is construction for crying out loud. This is no place for sissies and crybabies. But hey, if you think otherwise, you can go ahead and pack your shit up and don't dare show your face around here again. I mean, show it maybe once a month when you come to pay your installments. But other than that, oh, and plus extra to cover employee discount. He won't be enjoying it anymore. Damn. And then this was to Anila. I don't think we've seen this name. Accidentally 50 count. Uh, I haven't finished Ed Runners, but I need to. Yeah. Are you talking about the TV series, Zuku? Yeah, I already told you I don't give a crap about your warnings or restrictions or special term of use. I think we both know why you're not about to give me warranty on this crap. So don't make me pay out of my ass for nothing. Save the scop and let's do biz. Don't matter if they're salvaged from old military bases or fished out of some back alley ripper's dumpster. Shoot, could dig them up out of an Indian burial ground for all I care, long as they work. Hydraulics should be able to handle two metric tons. Nothing else matters. My people will buy whatever I sell them. So just get your people to give me what I ordered. Jeez. I can't imagine the workplace situations in the future, like in the setting, like the few that we have seen. Brutal. Pay or your head will explode. Nightmare. <laughs> That was one of the first um, phishing emails that I had seen. Or just like mass. Oh, oh, here we go. That's it. Message Regina. We never got Regina's initial message to begin with. Yeah, I got a fight at a construction site. Dude responsible is heavily ironed. Heard something about lasers. If you manage to get him alive, he'll be a great study for study candidate. Sending you the deets. One of our workers went psycho, started smashing up the construction site. Seems some of the workers tried to stop him, but their little poly one-shots couldn't pierce the exoskeleton of his. Anyway, they either ran or added to the construction. If you catch my drift, go check it out for me. Had to zero him, so I did kill him. I didn't mean to. I didn't do it. Shame you couldn't save him. Poor guy almost completely spiraled out before he realized what was happening. My, my, now that's some creative management. Seems this developer has no problem creating a wide range of business needs and solutions. I'm sure his long-standing connections with weapon dealers, the NCPD, and other shady souls help enormously. And if a certain need isn't great enough, well, there's always unusual or usual solutions of arm twisting and kneecapping. The key to success remains flexibility, especially with the moral sort. Yes, even the pneumatic arms can't lift moral. Morale in toxic workplace, damn. Oh, I I keep forgetting to send it to her. There we go. She left me on red. I thought he was still alive. I did, I, cause I thought I was leaving him, but he must have died from something else. Was he on fire? All right, guys, y'all know the drill. We're going into cool. We're trying to get this dead eye. I don't know if it's worth it. Is it that worth it? We're gonna throw this up twice. I still can't really put my perk points into something. Mitigation chance when aiming from cover. I am taking a lot of cover. He died from a bullet to the head. I thought it said 1%. I didn't realize how much of it we gonna do. Uh, when crouched or not moving, when crouched, the higher your mitigation chance, the longer it takes for enemies to detect you. Plus 10% movement speed after neutralizing an enemy wall undetected. Hmm. Throwable items, not relevant. Uh, let's go back to technical abilities for the uh, push it to the limit chrome. Right. Pyromania. 8% recharge speed for health items and grenades. 10%. Oh, yeah. Done. 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 So we have 5% movement speed and 10% explosion damage for 12 seconds after hitting an enemy in combat with an explosion from a grenade, explosive device, or projectile launch system. Yeah. And then what do we have? What are the offshoots from it? 10% mitigation chance per stack of pyromania. We're in this city. We built this city. 50% resistance to damage and effects from explosions you cause. <laughs> Why do I feel like I would need that? If he thanks for the follow. I feel like I'd actually need that. Flash sale for flash smoke and recon grenades. Double grenade charges, double recharge rate. I think... If I look in for 20, ticking time bomb. We're definitely gonna respec at some point. Nah, that wasn't me. Chuckable. It was he was found shot in the head with a sniper. 
<sighs> it wasn't me. Charge is a powerful EMP that nearly hits. Okay. No, I'm not really. Apply stun and deals damage. I could see it, but like last chance. I think we're looking at cellular adapter. This is all shotgun, right? No, tech weapons. We haven't been messing with tech weapons, and I feel like if I'm going to go technical ability, I need to mess with that and just see. But I don't think I've just applied any. It wasn't me. New Chai, welcome back in. Countdown. Breaking the ice. Hmm. Yeah, this is just embarrassing. To be going technical and still be just a level 11. For shame. Sid Wires, thank you for five months and hello. Happy Friday. It feels so weird streaming on a Friday, but I kind of like it. For some reason, it feels almost calmer than a Monday or Thursday. Sid Wise, thank you. Shaggy 2024. I need to do it. I need to do it. <laughs> right. Let's do another Cyber Psycho. We've been doing two Cyber Psychos per episode. Not that I mean we're going to stick with this or anything, but for now. Wait, is my clothing store nearby? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. All right, let's go to that clothing store first. Clothing store and then another cyber psycho. Millie. Oh, yeah, Millie's gone, gone. Not gone, gone. But. Oh, I'm sure. Reflex. I forgot about this song. Get in, nerds. We're going shopping. Should be this route. We can go this way. We have to shop before we kill. We can't go this way. We can't go this way. Well, we kind of can. The roads need to be repaired out here. Millie is immortal. Mortal instruments? Why am I thinking? Oh, mortal instruments. Wee! That's so cool. Wee! Whoa, whoa. Caliente. I've got a really good mechanic. No kidding. Uh, Warlord, no, I haven't played Phantom Liberty. I'm still in base game. Like, I'm still sub 50 hours in the game. Uh, we'll park her on the side of the road. Excuse me? You're not going to reflex. You won't. Elden Ring is amazing. Have you played other Souls games? I missed that. Yes. Did you say you, you played other Souls on? games? Sorry. All right, what do we got? What do we got? New items. Oh, is that a beanie? Beanie? Okay, beanie with no clothes on. I see. The roads need repair. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, what was that? The, uh, what was that? A saw? What was that? The roads need repairing, then you need to look at some of the roads in the UK. <laughs> I didn't feel like they were that bad, but Granted, I was in London, and I feel like we took mostly public transportation, so maybe I wasn't looking. It was all cobblestone. Everywhere I went, I felt like it was cobblestone. Um, oh, yeah, I kind of liked this, but it just feels like lounging around. My clothes. Where did my clothes grow? Great question. Um, I. Oh, those are what I've been looking for my whole life. Yes. Uh, great question. <laughs> I think I stored them because I was trying to make more room. Ooh, no. Oh. No. Well, no. No, the tiger. How? No. This is too, like, too leathery, you know? The roads are bad in the UK. <laughs> I have to dodge those potholes. Oh, I can't imagine the potholes. I guess I'm going to need to do more observation on roads. I always look at, like, where I'm staying and stuff, but I guess I'm not observing the roads enough. I kind of like these pants. There's something about them that's kind of cool. Done. No. Ah, uh, it's the cowboy hat with the, uh... <gasps> Did I already have these? With the red, and then I think I sold them after I slept with her. Yeah, I think so. I'm hoping Pan Am is watching, I do. Uh, I did not go on... No, 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 I wasn't in... No, 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 it's because I have an outfit. I've been wearing the Roach Whisper, so that's why you're seeing me. I was wearing clothes on that mission. I was wearing clothes. I was. Uh, the turquoise? I kind of like. 
I don't need that. I don't need to pay overtime. Uh, I could go with this like futuristic cowboy neon pants with the neon hat vibe. Like we could go these pants with these. We'll mess around with it. We'll see what happens. Something could come out of it. Kelly, like, please, no, please. I'm gonna buy these. Oh, my orange pants. I love orange pants. I don't know why. I just really like orange pants and I've never bought them like in real life because I feel like it just always makes me think of orange is the new black. So I never do, but I wish I could. Rattlesnake, no. Some good looking shorts right there. Ty, thanks for the follow, welcome in. Mmm, the Milwaukee Barbie vibes. That's actually a sick jacket. That's actually pretty cool. Switch individual parts when you're wearing a set. Yeah, when whenever you go to buy them, I think you can't. Yeah, I wasn't wearing any individual. Yeah, I didn't have anything on. I guess I did take all my clothes off. Uh, I feel like this is just gonna come in handy. Everybody needs a crop top, you know? Mmm. I like him. Done. I need every single color. <laughs> no. I look like a wrapped burrito. It's like a Chipotle burrito. Oh, I didn't mean to buy those. I didn't mean to buy those. Damn it. All right. This is basic shades. I think I actually own something kind of like this. So we're going to buy that one too. Nope. No blue jeans. They're not comfortable now. They're not going to be comfortable then. Ah, yes. The luxurious Chipotle burrito wrapped in the matte black. It just makes me think of Joker, but I'm not opposed to it. No. Hmm. No, I can't deal with the, the weird like bubbles on that. Okay, I think that's it. Whatever we have, we'll see what works. Wait, what? Okay, so go into inventory. So the chatters who just got here for the first time, welcome, <laughs> welcome, welcome, good Philly guys. Thanks for the follows. Welcome in. All right. I lost all my other baseball caps. Oh, I have to go somewhere else, don't I? To change my fit? Hold on. To the wardrobe. I'm mind blinking. All right, we're going to go ahead and just unequip everything and see what we have. Yep, 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 yep. No. Grim Reaper, stop. Stop. This can not be real. An ambulance hit a pothole in the UK and the man was declared dead. The man who was declared dead came back to life. <laughs> no, I shouldn't be laughing. No, no, no. Uh, first things first. Hold on. I... <laughs> trying to find a shirt up in this place. Where where are my clothes? Did I not buy everything? I thought I bought everything. Where's that? That's my new top. Okay. I need to decide. <laughs> Average UK road. I thought I sold these pants. The flashbacks. No. All right. Let's look at the futuristic cowboy. The howdy. I don't hate it. Wait, I guess you would need more of this stuff, right? Wait, I actually like, I don't. <laughs> what is the, oh! <laughs> I look like a futuristic person selling Mary Kay products. This is so, oh my gosh, I'm going door to door knocking still. Oh no, what kind of shoes do I have? I. Oh no, Felix, thank you for seven months, Golden Girls. I'm in my Golden Girls era. <laughs> Scarred, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. I guess it's missing the shoes. We can't wear this outfit until we get shoes. None of the shoes work with it. I mean, kind of those, but not really. Mmm. Human candy. This is cotton candy. This is the image of futuristic cotton candy. I feel so neon cowboy. I'll tell you what, they're gonna see me coming from a mile away. Oh my gosh. I do love these boots though. All right, once I get better, ne once I find neon cowboy boots, we can rock this. It's cotton candy times Barbie. <laughs> Don't know why this isn't my fit right now. I'm running out to the store to grab this as we speak. I just love orange pants. I just want to own a pair of orange pants, but I'm not bold enough. 
Um, I have so many jackets. So, so many jackets. I'm gonna unequip the jacket. Hold on. Mm. There is shapeless crime. <laughs> you can't go shape. I need to change the hat. It's the turquoise hat. It's just, yeah, it's all sorts of wrong. It's all sorts of wrong. All right, we're gonna go with the, I still haven't found the proper. Wait, wait, wait. Felix, how are you doing, by the way? But I really love Cyberpunk 27 when you played it. It's been a while. It's been a while. Oh, that's a millionaire, 60-year-old Karen from the countryside in 100 years. She does all the drugs. All the drugs. I'm just trying to get through the day. I'm definitely a whole bottle of wine type of girl right before I go to bed. The sheer amount of drip on this screen. <laughs> See, I don't even have any cool, like, tops to match this. Like, I don't have anything rocking. You know what? I think the cotton candy outfit was the best I could go... Was the best I could go with. I... I oh, gosh, it's the pants. It's the pants, I know. Uh, nothing's working for me right now. Whoa, when did I get these pants? It's kind of fun. Oh, okay, I have always liked these pants. I have always liked these pants. Uh-huh. Yeah, I do have a different pair of glasses, too. Oh. All right. This is good. This is good. It's the jacket. We need a jacket to pull this all together. Wait, where are my flannels? Yeah, where are my flannels? I was hoping they'd be selling more flannels. Oh. <laughs> Felix, I... It's been going. It's been going. I mean, I'm learning. I have zero. I have zero taste in fashion. <laughs> Hear me out. I, I, I kind of like it. It's like this like fun onesie. I can't. I, I don't even know what it is. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> oh my, what is it? <laughs> there we go. Dirty mechanic look, uh-huh, uh-huh. I have no fashion sense, none of these. GTA 6 isn't even out yet, relax. <laughs> I feel like it would be this over anything. An F1 mechanic over here. Gran Turismo, let's go. Gran Turismo? I just, I feel like we need to mix it up. I've been going to Cowboy this whole time, you know? It's... Uh... Yeah, I, I just have to stick with the flannel. My conscience says that I gotta go with the flannel. It might be the future, but the style stays the same, you know? And then we just have to change... Uh, no. I don't hate it. I don't, I don't hate it. I need like loose fitting pants. Okay, I kind of like this. And I know it's horrible, but I kind of like it. I wish it tucked into the pants. I think we keep talking about these pants. I just wish this is exponentially better. I just wish they tucked into the pants, that's all. We need, we need different flannels. That's, oh, okay, those pants kind of work. See, I feel like if you're gonna do the tight crop top, you need loose pants and a loose, yeah. This was my style before I started streaming. How do you know? I'm still looking for the legendary. Don't make me bring them back. I'm looking for the legendary. Uh... They do have more flannel. Where's the flannel shop? The legendary overalls do not exist yet. I kind of like this. <clears throat> I'm bringing them back. I'm bringing them back. I'm bringing them back. Basketball shorts are in. All right. Wait. Oh, this is what happened. Why is it locked out? Because I have to remove this. I did all of that for nothing. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. I can only work with... Oh, no. I'd have to go into my stuff to get it back. All right. Fine. I just got to go with what I have, guys. I have to. I. I have to wear what I currently have. Okay. <laughs> oh 
Uh, okay, it actually isn't the worst thing out of everything I put on. It's just the hat that's, uh... Oh, the hat. Nope, no, that's not any better. It's the... <laughs> the hat is the best part. It somehow is working. Oh, it's improved on it? It's improved. Take off the hat. I have to have a hat. Let me see if she has different hats. Hold on. Let me see the different hats she has. Hold on. She has other hats. Should we go beanie? Oh, um, right, 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 right. She has the ones with the, yeah, I'll just go reinforced. I'll just buy all the cowboy hats, it's fine. Just buy them all, and this beanie. All right, let me see. Wait. Actually, not that bad if we change this. We need like an orange cowboy hat. Not horrible. Not horrible. Not great. Yes, no, all right, going to the map, we're going to do another Cyber Psycho. <laughs> there we go, neutralized threat. I am going to go cotton candy, Barbie. But we need gray hair and we need to age ourselves up a little bit. It hurt you guys with the pom-pom. It's just used to straighten me out. Happy meal, thanks for the follow as well. Felix, has it been a good kind of busy lately? Skirt! The song is not growing on me. Back riding with the Millie, the Milster. Every time I jump in the car, it Millie always plays this. Eyes on the prize. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Never charge somebody. All right, here we go. Hey, heard about a massacre at a homeless camp. The Pearl Jam, please. Send you the info I have so far, but it's pretty thin. Jora, thanks Probably for the follow as well. It's a cyber psycho. Oh, and I prefer if he didn't die. Why are you gonna drop that shade? You kill one cyber psycho and all of a sudden. It's pretty damn odd. Could be a net runner. Can't quite rule out a remote attack. Still, what would they be looking for in Arroyo bum camp? Something's off here. Pop over and check it out. I feel like it was only two because I reloaded. I reloaded. Doc, welcome back in. On a scale of 9 out of 10, probably an 11. Realistically, probably an 11. Counterfeit documents. Is he Lizzie? He's still alive. This is gonna be short circuit weapon. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm dead. I'm pretty sure I'm in the middle of dead. I'm in the middle of dead. Ugh. I should have saw that one for me. I'm in the middle of dead? Let's see. <laughs> Easily game of the year. For this year, it'll be interesting. It'll be hard to decide between this and something else. I should have saved right before. I was on the edge. Hold on. Roger. Buckle up. Requesting additional backup. Buckle up. Dispatch, do you copy? <laughs> Follow me. 
soldiers! <laughs> Millie! <laughs> Here we go. All units. Suspect has evaded patrol. Resume search immediately. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Get out, Millie. Best of luck, baby. I'm out. Captain Thickrod, welcome back in. Hello. Also, Six, thank you for the follow as well. Okay. Millie's the best with the music. It's a whole, it's a whole thing. Shoops, hi. Good morning. Good evening. All right, we answer this. We're going to save after this. Send you the info I have so far, but it's pretty thin. You probably already gathered it's a cyber psycho. Oh, and Sir I'm sorry if you didn't sexy. die. Uh, we're gonna yoink this. Here we go. Cosby and Ludic. Hey, Tony, can you send some more stuff to me? Yesterday I fell asleep in a tub and must have froze my fingers because I can't feel anything. Scanned all of Valentino's haunts and still can't find him. It's likely Lily vanished into thin air. Lily, no digital traces, nothing. None at all, maybe check at the dollhouse, but it's pretty hard to breach their sub. Maybe just give it a rest. He'll come back once he gets homesick and maybe he just needs space. Don't say I didn't warn you about the Valentinos. They're like that. One day they're professing their everlasting love and the next they disappear sin parola and all you're left with is some dirty socks. Don't, oh. Don't even try to pull that I told you so crap on me. You don't even know him. And you're, and you're putting him in a box with everyone else. And FYI, he does his own laundry. Listen, these fingers are as good as dead now. Can you set me up with some Ganic implants? Oh man. All right, just relax and get some rest. I'll get you what you need. Just promise me you'll get some shut eye. So they went and got implants just to save, I'm assuming their son or somebody they loved, a family member. Charmide, thanks for the follow, welcome in. All right, we're gonna save here. Here we go. Yeah, we're definitely gonna try to keep them alive. Man, they did what they could to get somebody out. I, I'm sure, like all jokes aside, I'm sure there are a lot of different reasons why people get pushed to having implants, but it's probably not that rare of an occurrence in this night city to get implants to probably save somebody that you love. I could see it. Doesn't sound so crazy. Okay. Initiate overload. We gotta go. Woo! Weapon glitch. Oh, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Just initiate overload on this guy. Okay. Okay. There's another one. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Not good. Not ideal. Fine. Oh yeah, it was probably because of her son. Yeah, I'm assuming son. Oh, she's gonna get her health back, I think. Oh, yeah, it just, it, it thinks we're done. Oh, I was, I was gonna say, I think I just glitched it out. It was. It was starting to be pom pom again. I think a sheep. Is this a real fight? I don't think this is a real fight. Okay, now it seems like a real fight. Now it seems like a real fight. <laughs> okay, I need to actually use a pistol because I don't want to. Oh. I don't want to kill her in the head. Oh, hold on. I need to go with like a pistol or something. Something. <laughs> Leave her at 1%. Oh no, I think I killed her. No, 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 no. Okay, she's alive, she's alive. Nice. Woo, okay, I really thought I was gonna get her there. Oh, please pin that next time she plays pom pom. What do you mean? I think he's pinning it for different reasons. Mm-hmm. Psycho was a younger runner. Think she must have OD'd, then ducked outside at the last minute, afraid she'd been left to rot all alone. One of the bums from the camp took her in, but when she woke up, her mind was cracked. Guess she thought they kidnapped her. Who knows? Maybe there wasn't a thought at all between her ears. Just a droning buzz. But anyway, she awaits your mystery treatment. 
Mm. Rolls, welcome in. When the music stops or the bug, it bugs out the fight. It kind of is all glitchy all over the place, yeah. It's easy to exploit. No, <laughs> it won't be easy to reverse what she's been through, but I'm glad you didn't kill her nonetheless. With the right care, she might be able to get back up on her feet. I wish you could see what happens to all of these people too. Oh, we're wearing the same pants. We're basically sisters. Oh, shit. Okay, let me see this. Archived conversation as well. We can scan this. I'm responsive, no pulse. Frog, sigh. Okay. Uh, what happened to the conversation? There we go. These are different people. More and more got a girl. Congrats, she and wait. Everyone deserves love and happiness. No, not that kind of girl. What kind? Someone tossed her in a sewer. Looks like a net runner. Probably thought she was dead. Shim, are you trying to get your ass zeroed? What? Leave her alone. This never ends. Oh, come on. That's just superstition. I'm not being superstitious. Anyway, need some meds for her. You got something? She needs help. She's barely breathing. Should just take her to a ripper. No, should do it myself. No idea who's after her. Okay. Did I kill the person that was taking care of her as well? Data, no name on them. No name on the people, so we don't know if that was who took her in. Sisters of the Traveling Pants. <laughs> Bonding after I've taken her out, but only after. It is the sister of the Traveling Pants. Jess wanted to do that with a pair of pants we found at a thrift shop because they fit her and they fit me. And we were like, Anna, do it. And Anna, Anna didn't want to. And I was like, they're not going to fit you. And I was like, you're not that much taller. <laughs> Cam, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. You're not that much taller. Look at the futuristic shopping carts. What do you think that's even for? What does that do? What does it really do? She did to herself after recovery. Instead of a Cyber Monday, we need a Cyber Bag. <laughs> Seeing what I look like all cybered out. What just happened to my body there? I feel like my shoulders were a lot more broader. Texting while... <laughs> I know. <laughs> Texting while doing it. Now it's telling me to meet with Takimura. That's interesting. It must be... Is it cute to go to whatever your closest main objective is? I guess so. There's a gig. Okay. What have we done so far? I feel like we barely got anything done tonight. Cybercaster for October, maybe. I did, I, I keep saying like, I wanna do this where you guys can do like a total uh, redemption where I'll do like a look at the end of normal playthroughs and not just in October. Could be like Swedish stores where you have your bank card attached to the handheld scanner and we skip till. Wait, and we can skip the till. That was the coolest thing. When I was in London, this just made me think of it, but I went to a checkout to get a NOCO and my pair of shoes because I wore the wrong shoes and they were too small and I didn't want to break them in. So I got these like cheap little sneakies and I just put them in and it scanned it. It just knew what it was by weight alone or by what? How does that work? I've never seen one of those here. I wasn't here for the most of it. But the short time we have, we've done a lot. We did do a ton of our girl Pan Am stuff. So we'll pick back up with Pan Am tomorrow. I'm surprised we've got 309 gigs for her done. And we did two Cyber Psychos and we did do a lot of NCPDs. I mean, look at that. Wait, it's because I don't have it on. Hold on. Hold up. <laughs> you know, it's really starting to look better. I say if we take out all of these tomorrow, that's cutting off a major part of the map. And it really is just congesting it to the city. I don't think that's bad. Yep. Oh, really? We actually didn't crush. We didn't crash that much this time. I think we crashed less this time, if anything. <laughs> what is going on here? I feel like we didn't crash as much as last time. It was nice to hang here for the first time. Yes, uh, especially there were so many new people that popped in from YouTube today, whether it was a lot of people from Outer Wilds as well. And so I'm glad you guys are enjoying that. If you are enjoying Outer Wilds in the YouTube channel. The next episode will go up tomorrow. Um, I normally upload Saturdays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays if you guys haven't caught on to that. But I will be back tomorrow. The reason I'm kind of ending a little bit more than five or under five hours is because I'm going to be back here in uh, just about 12 hours at 10 a.m. 10 a.m. Santa's coming. Um, so I will be back here in a little bit and I will see you guys. We got to do some story tomorrow. That was Pan Am's thing. Wasn't, oh, Takimura says, 
No, wait. What? What? I thought Pan Am's was the story. Not really, Skid, no. Master Punk, have a good night. Pi, have a good night. Nov, as well. Am I... Mm, Boston, thank you. Yes, as well. Thank you so much. Pan Am is main mission. You guys have me thinking I wasn't doing main aim. Yeah. Here's to better luck with Pan Am tomorrow. Also getting rejected by probably the love of my life at this point. Oh, it's her hair. It's everything. It's everything. It's everything. Evelyn is a story. Evelyn. The space between oh we need to do jig jig street too by the way there is a couple side missions that i'd like to do over here and the booths were made for walking yeah i think what we'll do is we'll pick back up with a couple of side missions and um yeah we'll go from there we'll do some ncpd we'll do a little bit of everything i think i feel significantly less overwhelmed now that i'm just taking it episode by episode trying to just check off a little bit here and there because i think the most cumbersome things are those jobs not even the jobs but the gigs and the cy cyber psychos those yeah those we gotta just slowly chip away like the mines you know dc dc thank you for 38 months of continual support as well and it's here too are you at it wait did you just pop in or are you at work right now spurious good night the yellow circles are all the main missions yeah, or like side missions, right? Side and main missions, because isn't that what the jobs? Wait a minute. I see what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, you've got the grayed out and then you have the main mission stuff. So you've got Pan Am, Ta Takimura, and something else. Oh, I think actually that other one is the gig, the job, or yeah, the gig. Wait, no, 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 no. It's up above. It's uh, Jig Jig Street. Yeah, for Judy. Jig Jig for Judy. Oh, I forgot about that. Maybe we can do a little bit of each of them as well. You're on a work break. Overzealous, have a good night. Ribo as well, good night. Yeah, so we'll pick back up tomorrow. What else? I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, it was really nice to just have a Friday stream and even if it was just for a little bit i think as long as we're playing cyberpunk or some of these longer games don't be surprised if i just do a little bit of a pop-up stream here and there uh to get a little bit of it done i think also stand by for tomorrow and sunday will be cyberpunk but maybe monday i might end up doing monday or thursday i might end up just doing more of a cozy game and just kind of seeing how that works and if i'm enjoying it normally i don't like to juggle more than like the two games i'm doing on youtube and on stream but i kind of been warming up to this idea of like keeping a kind of cozier game going so maybe on saturday or sunday we'll talk about which one and beans yes everybody who came in today thank you so much for your time above anything else Mel Hello, it's a cozy rainy weekend, which is perfect for all the cyberpunk we're going to get done. Uh, tomorrow's going to be a normal five hour, but Sunday I'm going to try to do a little bit longer. And yeah, I will see you guys back here tomorrow, 10 a.m. Uh, early morning cartoons. Cliff Bar, have a good one. Thank you so much. And everybody, thank you for the resubs. Babyface, there are a lot of new faces and follows as well. And just again, anybody who's popped over from YouTube, thank you so much. Inconvenience, goodbye. Gamer, goodbye. Clout, goodnight. Lamba, classy. R. Kelly, there it is. Can I get a Creed? Can I get a Creed play? Gamer Pete, good night. Zoo, good night. Nat, good night. Overzealous. Mikey, Steve, Neo. Also, I might just go order some pizza. No, I should go to bed. No. Mm. I should finish Edge Runners. That's what I need to do. I need to order pizza and watch some Edge Runners. Zoo. Yes. Arms wide open. Welcoming that pizza into my house. Art, good night. Good job. Good night. DC, JJ, Classy, anybody that's lurky turkey or can't because of the verified only. I hope you guys have a good night. Kelly, nah, good night. Yes, Scoom. Scoom, good night. Chuckable. Pizza and Edge Runner sounds like the perfect night to end this. Absolutely. Poor day. Thank you for the follow. Super. Yes. All right. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go order pizza and I'm going to watch at least one episode of Edge Runners. I can't promise you guys any more than that, but I'll at least do one episode. Reflex, good night. G Cali, good night. And just again, if you guys have gotten a gifted sub from anybody, I hope you give them a big thank you. And I will look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow. Okay. Bye. Bye 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 bye.